What's going on, people? Welcome back to Curtis Shaw TV, back with another shameless op along, people, as we watch Manchester United against Liverpool. And uh, you know me, I'll be completely neutral today, not supporting anyone. United! 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 Marcus Rashford FC today, people. Yeah, as I said, completely neutral. But big up to everyone locked in. Yesterday was a good day for the Arsenal, big win, 3-0, killer Kai Havertz, Dipset, Harlem, Bird Gang. But today, oh, Man United, please, just one performance. I don't care what happens the rest of the season. Just today, people have actually called me Rashford's lawyer at times. Come on, just one performance on that pitch today. And uh, listen, help us in our race for the title. But big up to everyone locked in today. Hope you're well. It's going to be shameless just embrace it. How Beast is in the chat. He's a big Liverpool fan. Big up to you, bro. Um, don't let them come to your house and eat your food. You know what I mean? Come on, United, man. What are you playing at? Viva Garnacho. Running down the wing. Wow, United sing. Viva Garnacho. Come on, United. Let's go. We're going to be A. Hey, all of this today, people. Marcus Rashford. Let's go, my friend. Let's go. Shameless settings. Um, but big up to everyone locked in. And uh, we'll look at the league table and what this is going to potentially mean um, to the rest of the league. Firmal said, United to, be United to beat means more FC. Glory, glory, man. United, shameless. Bro, it's that. we got to do what's necessary, bro. we got to do what's necessary. Uh, apparently, Ajax are losing. Somebody said they're losing 6-0. To Feyenoord, is that true? 6-0, that's unbelievable. But I know they've had a, a bad season this year. I saw the end of the old firm game. That was a game, by the way, 3 all. Um, let's have a look. 6-0 to Feyenoord. And um, that brother Jimenez, who people have been chatting about, he hasn't scored any of them. He's got one assist. No goals, uh, which is interesting. Uh, Sporting Lisbon... Beat um, Benfica last night as well. Um, Jokeres didn't score in that game, but they are top of the league now um, with a little points gap as well. Uh, apparently, Timber scored. Yeah, Quinton Timber, Yuri and Timber's brother. Highly rated, apparently. Um, but anyway, let's focus on this. And this, we need Man United to do something. Could that defeat to Chelsea work in their favour and our favour? Because... That is unacceptable at any level, and surely there's going to be a reaction today. I've got a lot of friends who are Man United fans. I've got friends from Manchester, and they always say to me, this is the game that means the most to them. It's not even Manchester City. They don't have the same rivalry with City because growing up, there wasn't no real rivalry. City were went down to League One at one stage. This is the one that matters the most. They have to turn up and perform. And they did beat them in the FA Cup a few weeks ago. So, am I confident? No. Because any back four that's got Harry Maguire in it is scary hours, people. But I'm just hoping there's some sort of reaction. Um, let's talk about the teams, people. Let's start with the home team, Manchester United. Andre Anana. Oh, na, 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 na. Oh, na, 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 na. I need a performance from him. Let a shot straight through his hands against Chelsea. Um, Wambasaka at right back, Dallo at left back, uh, and it's young Camboala and Maguire at centre back. I mean, I don't know how that's going to work. I don't really know how good that Camboala is. Young player. I mean, Liverpool have got a couple of young players in the, their back four, so can we give them an excuse? Not really. Um, Varane's out again. Um, the midfield, Casemiro and. Uh, Kobe Mainu, Kobe Mainu, I didn't think had the best of games the other day against uh, against Chelsea. Um, but listen, he is a good player. Bruno Fernandes will play in the 10 role. He's the captain. Ganacho on the right, Rashford on the left, and Rasmus Hoyland up top. Rashford was benched against Chelsea for Anthony. Anthony is dropped. Rashford comes in. I mean, Rashford's a lot better than Anthony. And uh, listen, he's got to turn up. This lazy Rashford that's jogging around, doesn't want to press. You can't be doing that today, bro. We need a performance. 
Do you know what I'm saying? We need United to perform today. And uh, hopefully we get the Rashford of last season who was doing this celebration. I can't lie. You know, a young centre-back and Maguire and Liverpool are going to get at that centre-back partnership. Um, whether it's good enough, I don't know. But hey, let's see. Um, on the bench, um, Bayern Deer, I think that's the goalkeeper. Mason Mount, Amrabat, Eriksen, uh, Ahmed Diallo, uh, Anthony. Forson, Amas, and Habib. So there's some young players there. Um, so I don't know how good those those lads are. Fish Eagle said, "Big up Curtis from the Twitch community. Appreciate your streams. Let's hope, man, you can at least hold them to a draw." Big up everyone locked in. Over a thousand of you already. And listen, we don't support any of these clubs, so appreciate the support. Thirty-two of you on Twitch. Big up the whole C unit. Big up each and every time. And uh, we're all here, people. We're all here for the same reason. Marcel says, bun your hate along, Curtis, up the mighty Reds. I don't like to call it a hate along. I think hate is a weak, weak emotion. I call it an op along. It's an op along, a shameless op along, people. Big up Marcel, though. Big up Dud Pistachio. He said, locked in, hit the likes. Hopefully, we get a wounded animal effect working on United. Bless up Curtis Cruz and the community. You're right, bro. We need the wounded animal effect from Man United today, you know. They think they've got them, they think, and all of a sudden, they jump up and bite them. That's what we need. Uh, as Ziggy said, insane decision from the bold fraud to start Casemiro. I mean, maybe Mason Mount, but Mount doesn't really play in that double pivot as well. Maybe Amrabat, but Amrabat, I think they've already said they're not signing him. And Ericsson, I think his legs have gone, so... I don't know who they could have gone with. Maybe Mason Mount, but has he got that discipline to play in that role? But Casemiro looked like he had a caravan on his back against Chelsea. He couldn't move. He really couldn't. Um, let's hope he can today. Anthony was man of the match for Chelsea. Rashford equals Jogger Benita. Listen, Anthony's trash. I don't care if he played well against Chelsea. I still don't rate that guy one bit. One of the worst signings I've ever seen at Man United. Um... So I would rather, at least you know if Rashford plays well, he's capable. Can we still chip in with Arsenal comments? Absolutely, people. Listen, let's have a look at the league table. Arsenal fans, don't think just because we're watching Man U against Liverpool, we're not going to talk about Arsenal. You're damn right we're going to talk about Arsenal. Who's top of the tree? Who's top of the league? Who's got the most goals? Who's got the best defence? Who's got killer Kai Havertz, dipset bird gang up front, people? You're damn right we're going to talk about Arsenal. You don't need to ask permission for that. At any given moment, you talk about Arsenal. And it will always be accepted, people. It's like cash accepted everywhere. What a performance yesterday by the Gunners, by the way. 2pm tomorrow, we'll talk about it in more detail. Got a very busy day tomorrow. I'm doing the Bayern Munich preview on AFTV tomorrow morning. I'm going to record my own preview at the ground come back, we'll do the 2pm show, go over the Brighton game, player ratings, all that stuff. Yesterday, in my opinion, was one of the best performances this season by Arsenal. Absolutely no doubt about it. Um, we made Brighton look like Bristol Rovers yesterday. A team that's only lost one home game this season in the Premier League. That was light work. That was light work, people. We went to Brighton and sent them to the Pebble Beach. Light work. The Zerbi ball, all of that. Controlled the game. Passed the ball well. Defended like a brick wall. Opened them up. At the, you know, they couldn't deal with us. We attacked them time after time. Should have scored four or five yesterday, in my opinion. Havertz scores. Saka gets a goal. Trossard chips the goalkeeper. That performance was outstanding. And uh, listen, I'm, I'm looking forward to talking about it in more detail tomorrow when we do player ratings. But listen, for me, one of the most mature, complete performances that I've seen from Arsenal this season. It's as simple as that. You're talking about a performance that still on paper, if I said to you now, write down Arsenal's strongest team on paper, that team yesterday is still arguably... The left-back wouldn't be Zinchenko. I think Partey would be in the midfield. I think Martinelli would be on the left. And Saka's still not fully fit. There's something still not totally right. So you're still looking at a team that's got three players that can go into it to improve it. So listen, man, we've, we've got to keep performing and, and keep winning and see where it takes us. As I've said, my only thought process that has changed slightly is that 
I've watched Man City in the last couple of weeks and I don't want to, obviously, I'm, tr I'm not trying to speak this into existence, but I have a feeling Man City might win every game. So in that case, it may take seven out of seven wins for us to win the title, which is a big ask, but we're capable of it. We're capable. We're better than every other team that we're going to play against. So it may take that level of quality to win this title. It's one of the hardest title races we've probably ever seen. We've never really seen three teams this close to each other. It's unbelievable. Uh, Trossard's chip can never be better than uh, the Curtis chip. Run that blood clot intro. Listen, it's Sunday. I'm about the community. Run that blood clot! <laughs> One time only. I'm sorry, you know. You, you said run that Ross, you know, run that blood clot. I couldn't hold it back, you know. But listen, Trossard, it was a good effort. Mine was further out. Haters will say it's offside, but no VAR at that level. So just, just you know, just accept it. I think I was onside, to be fair. Anyway, let's concentrate on the arse. Stand up if you hate Tottenham. I mean, I've seen it. I refuse to ignore it if my eyes cross it, people. I won't, I won't, uh, I won't avoid that. But listen, we have got bigger and more difficult games coming, in my opinion. I do think Tottenham away. I do think Man United away will be... Um, will be difficult for us, but I think we can beat all of them. And uh, defences win titles, people. Defences win titles. Anyway, anyway, United. The shameless celebrations today, people. Just, I, I'm, I'm going to say to the community, and every Arsenal fan, of course, you will understand, um, this is going to be shameless. It's only happening for today. It won't happen again unless it's necessary. But for 90, 95, 96, 97 minutes, it is glory, glory Man United. It is U.R. Cantona. It is Viva Ronaldo. It's Roy Keane. It's Gary Neville. It's Paul Scholes. It's Ruud van Nistelrooy and all of the above people. Forgive me, but you know we have to do what's necessary. We need that positive energy. Harry Maguire, I want him to look like Maldini, look like Beckenbau, look like Lillian Turam. It's it's necessary, people. So today, for one day only, United. United, 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 people. As soon as the game goes, you know, they're filthy scumbags. But for the next 95, 96 minutes, um, it's United, United, United. So, you know, Malcolm X said it. Someone just said it, you know, by any means necessary. However, we got to win this title. Then we will win the title that way, even if it means doing shameless things like this. I'm embracing it. I want all of you to embrace it as well. I will do the Rashford celebration if he scores. I will cheer like I'm in the Stretford end of that stadium. So, listen... It is what it is. It's necessary, people, so we have to forgive ourselves for this. Big up Riley in the chat. Hope you're well, bro. Big up Riley. Big up Louise. Big up Ian. Hope you're all tuned in. They're Liverpool fans, though, so, you know, I'm not going to wish you too much luck, but, hey, big up yourselves. Um, Busy says, Curtis, you're about to realise how terrible United and Ten Hag are. What watch along did I do with United? It was Man United, Man City. When Rashford scored that amazing goal, then he couldn't even control a ball for the rest of the game. And uh, I, I remember saying I've basically wanted Man United to win for 90 minutes. And it's the most stressful game I've ever watched. They stink. Their football absolutely stinks. Man United are horrific, honestly. And I'm sorry to talk about them in this manner, bearing in mind in 14 minutes we want them to win a game. But their football is woeful. Absolutely woeful. It's individual brilliance, FC. They're, they're hoping that Ganacho can score or Rashford can shoot from 20 yards or Bruno scores a free kick or something. Their style of football and philosophy is absolutely non-existent. But hey, for the next 90 minutes, individual brilliance, FC, we will take it. We will take it. Um, transition basketball. You're not wrong. They're, I mean, they might as well put um, LeBron James up front. Um, I'm looking for a slabby masterclass. Listen, we need that fridge, Maguire, that big old slab on his head. Head everything out of that um, penalty area. Um, it's going to be interesting. They've listed it as Wambasaka on the right with Dallow on the left. Um, 
but we'll see. Do you know what I realised? I haven't even read out the Liverpool team. Um, the Liverpool team, by the way, and listen, they've got some players out as well. And uh, Kelleher's in goal. I thought Kelleher in the FA Cup game was at fault for both of them goals. You know, they are missing Alisson. Alisson, in my opinion, is the best goalkeeper in the Premier League. So he's still a big loss. Um, Keller in goal. Bradley at right back now. Bradley, who has been very highly rated, Connor Bradley. I think he is a good young defender. But that Adingra, who played for Brighton yesterday against Arsenal, he was ripping Connor Bradley apart last week. So Rashford, I'm not being funny, bro. But you need to be causing this Connor Bradley all sorts of problems today. Um, people saying Wan-Bissaka's listed at left back, so they're going to put Wan-Bissaka against Salah, which is interesting. So, listen, Rashford needs to be ripping this Connor Bradley apart, in my opinion. Uh, Robertson's at left back, very good left back. Virgil van Dijk and uh, Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa has looked good at centre back. Virgil van Dijk, I mean, he's a colossus. He is, I, you know, and I think Saliba is on the road to becoming one of, if not the best centre-back in the world for his age. But Virgil van Dijk's been the dominant force. Um, but listen, I, I've seen some things where they're saying, you know, it doesn't help that the midfield keeps changing and the defence keeps changing. One minute Trent's at right back, one minute Simicass at left back, next minute Canate's next to him. They need to take advantage of that. Rasmus Hoyland needs to cause problems and... Um, you know, Bruno needs to go and join in. Uh, their midfield, uh, Alexis McAllister, Endo and Sabozlai. It is a good midfield. I have to say, Alexis McAllister, you're looking at, I would say, top, maybe top three signings of the season in the Premier League this year. When you think £35 million, what can you get for £35 million in the modern market? I would say probably... Declan Rice, probably Cole Palmer and Alexis McAllister, possibly the signings of the season. Um, he's been really good. Endo, listen, they wanted Caicedo. They got Endo, I think, for 15 million. He's been solid as well. But I do think that he can be exploited if your midfield is active. But he is good. He will hunt you down as well. Uh, and then Sabozlai. Sabozlai's good start of the season really well. Faded a little bit. And then the front three, Luis Diaz, Mo Salah, Darwin Nunes. You know what you're going to get from those three. They'll be busy, they'll be active, they'll press. And uh, they won't give you a minute on the ball. Klopp's uh, pressing style will be relentless. But as I always say, this isn't Mane, Firmino and Salah. You know, that was the ultimate front three that they had. Um, this is good. But United need to handle business. If wan at left back, he's got to shut down Salah. And that's not easy. Um, and then you've got Dallo against uh, Diaz. And then Maguire and uh, Camboala, the youngster, against Darwin Nunes. You never really know what you're going to get with Darwin Nunes, to be honest. I think he's a good player, but a frustrating player as well. But they have got energy and they will be busy. They won't give you a moment to rest. Uh, did you stay up to watch WrestleMania, bro? I have not watched wrestling like for a whole like program since it was called WWF. I don't even know about this WWE, bro. When I was watching wrestling, it was WWF, Bret the Hitman Hart, uh, Ultimate Warrior, Hulk Hogan, Stone Cold, all them. That's what I... And WCW, Sting and them lot. I haven't watched WWE, bro. I really haven't. So, yeah, asking me about WrestleMania, that's like a foreign language to me. Uh, White Glove said, same Big C. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't watched wrestling for over uh, probably 15 years. Are we calling this a pray along, op along, or watch along? Probably all of the above, bro. Probably all of the above. Ultimate Warrior, man, that was my favourite. When he used to get up and start shaking on the ropes, him against Hulk Hogan. It was crazy. Listen, 2,000 of you locked in, which is unbelievable, considering, you know, I don't support any of these clubs. 46 of you on Twitch. Hit the like button. We're in subscriber-only mode. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And let's see what happens. I'm looking forward to the game. Ajax losing 6-0 away at Feyenoord. Feyenoord did score a seventh. It was disallowed for offside. Interesting. Santiago Jimenez, the striker, a lot of people have been saying Arsenal should go for him, hasn't scored. I mean, I'm not saying because of one bad game means we shouldn't go for him. 
Um, but, you know, 6 nil at home, you'd have expected him to have scored. He has been taken off now um, in that game. A couple other Premier League games today as well. Sheffield United against Chelsea and Tottenham against Forest. I don't think we're really interested in them games, to be honest. Um, Garnacho is better than Salah. That's, a, that's one of the worst comments I've ever seen in my life. Um, for today, I hope he plays better than Salah, but... I want to know what you was drinking last night because uh, I think you drank too much of it. Wayne's World said, Big C, it's going to be a close run league. Good luck, but this is the time for us to shine. Uh, let's see. Let's see. You know, who's going to who's gonna prove they're the ones? Players about to come onto the pitch six minutes till kickoff. Dre said, facts, Mr. Wonderful, Paul Orndor. Andre the Giant, big jo Lex Luger, yeah, them old school dons, man, in wrestling. Big up, Laser Gaming. Come on, United, listen. <sighs> Glory, glory, Man United for the next 90 minutes. I'm always interested in Tottenham losing. That's a good point. That's a good point. Yeah, he must be steaming. I mean, I I, I, I respect Man United today, but Man said uh, Ganacho is better than Salah. I just say, you know, I can't, I can't take that seriously. I'm afraid. Flight Mode said, uh, hypothetical question: Would a Premier League and Champions League double this season make Arteta Arsenal's greatest manager? That's too far. You've gone too far this time, Biggs. You've gone too far. Sorry, that's a it's a clip from Shot. As if you've watched it, you're right there with me. Um, it'd be up there as one of the greatest because we never won the Champions League. But Wenger took us into a different stratosphere, people. We were George Graham one 0 to the Arsenal, rock solid. Wenger brought football we've never seen in this country. Wenger brought Thierry to Arsenal, the greatest player we've ever had. It, it doesn't put him above Wenger, but he would be in the mix, that's for sure. If he won the Champions League and Premier League, I'd say build a statue. I'm not even joking. That's how much it would mean to us. I'd live off that uh, victory alone for a few decades. MJ said an FA Cup and you man's pain will do me fine. Salah Hattie. No chance. Um, no Salah Hattie, bro. Hey, Charles, the next Liverpool manager, too cool Joes. I don't think they'll go for anyone like that. They'll go for someone probably who's never been in the Prem, maybe the Sporting Lisbon manager. I still think uh, Xabi Alonso is a possibility. I wonder whether he was just saying he was staying to apply pressure. Why would Xabi Alonso stay at Leverkusen um, when you've got the, the potential to go to Liverpool. I think maybe the thing that Alonso's thinking, stay at Leverkusen for one more year. Ancelotti's got a year left on his deal. Xabi Alonso gets the Real Madrid job next summer. That could be what he's thinking. Big up White Glove, new member. I think you've been a member before, bro, but big up to you. Big up Snake Eyes. Hope you're well locked in. He's gifted five memberships. Really appreciate that, bro. And big up to the five new members. Welcome. Uh, over 2,100 of you locked in. Xavi Alonso is waiting for Real Madrid. He could be. Uh, right, listen. The players are coming on the pitch. It is Manchester United against Liverpool. United! 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 This is Coronation Street FC, people. United, Manchester, Marcus Rashford, lad. Let's do this. United, not City, lad. Not not Liverpool. United, Coronation Street. We'll be doing this celebration today, people. It is hammering down with rain. It always seems to rain in Manchester. But listen, let's do this. Manchester United, we are on your side today. Don't let us down. We will never be supporting you again, probably. Um, well, definitely not for this season. Don't let us down, please. I'll lock this stream off if it's going wrong, I'm telling you. I ain't got the patience. We've had a good weekend as Arsenal. Um, Eric Ten Hag, looking like a boiled egg. Can he produce something today? Come on. Coronation Street v Brookside, exactly. And, and Brookside, Jimmy Corkill, they stopped that. So um, Coronation Street lives on. Uh, get a fix said I live in the north of Manchester rain means it's summer they call it um liquid liquid sunshine don't they up there in Manny Pat does fitness big up big C locked in for the roller coaster listen it's gonna be a big game I know I think United will do something whether they'll win I don't know I really hope they do though 
Dude Pistachio said, uh, Pa just came out of surgery, got him listening to your streams this week. He's been waiting for the glory days to return. I met Wenger the season he signed. Got to tell you the story one day. Yeah, man, big up to your pops as well, bro. Lucky to meet Wenger. Um, I've seen him leaving the ground a few times. Never got the opportunity to talk to him. Today we are supporting United, absolutely, bro. If I had collars on this, I'd have them up like Cantona today, people. Ooh, ah, Cantona. Ooh, ah, Cantona. <laughs> yeah, United! Yeah, United! Come on, United! Let's do this. Uh, I mean for tonight, Big C, I'm sorry. Gonna take it back after two hours. Uh, yeah, 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 I get you. I respect it. I know. Shameless settings. Full time now, I'll be shameless. A kiss a United badge. Oh, my days. Um, first time supporting Disunited, uh, di Dishwasher United people. Uh, glory, glory, man, United. What's good in the hood? Zaheer said, um, Hi, Kurtz, do you think Arsenal's defence would have dealt with Pep's prime Barcelona? Mm. And Arsenal's invincibles. We'd have give it a good go, but you've got to remember... I mean, nah, I don't want us to get carried away. I think we're getting a bit carried away, you know. You're talking about Prime Messi. You know, Prime Messi, I don't know how you stop him. I've seen Prime Messi jogging past Real Madrid's back four. So, nah, who's our left back going to be? Zinchenko, Kivio, Karma, Karma. Invincibles, Thierry, I mean, I love Gabriel and them, but Thierry and Bobby Pirat, nah, 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 nah. We give it a good go, but... They'd kick the door down eventually, people. But I, re I like the optimism. I do respect the optimism. Uh, big C, a player I think we should go for is Danny Olmo. Yeah, talent of player. Talent of player. Just, mm, where would he play in the Arsenal team? That's the only thing. Um, Messi v Timber. Yeah, it would be a good battle. Right, we are about to get underway. Manchester United against Liverpool. The players take the knee. Come on, United. Let's do this. Let's do this, people. Manchester United, get us underway against Liverpool. Liverpool, Brookside. Against United, Coronation Street. Um, the balls in there is hammering down with rain. I just realised no Scott McTominay on the bench. What is that? Dallow gives it away. Dallow is at right back. Wambasaka at left back up against um up against Salah. Liverpool are on the attack already. Here is Mo Salah on the right hand side. Planet, I can't stand up for that. I just can't. I know we're here to support them for 90, but I don't look he said stand up if you love United. I can't do that, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're gone too far this time. You're gone too far. Big up for the super chat though, Planet MSU. Big up, bro. Um, Maguire, Harry Maguire with the challenge, right off his slab. Um, Liverpool have the ball back again, though. Nice to be able to watch along with little to no stress. Well, oh, Man United are in. It's Ganacho. Ganacho takes him. Yeah! Oh, he's offside, you absolute donut. Just put the flag up early. Don't make me celebrate like that. Why do they do that? They know he's offside. Put the flag up and stop it. Please just be onside somehow. Say they've got it wrong. He was in his own off. Play it, play it. Oh, why did he take so long to play that ball, man? Takes it round the goalkeeper. Puts it in the empty net. Bruno, a split second. You play that ball quicker and it's 1-0. Damn. Nearly, nearly. Linesman knew he was offside. Waits for him to touch it. Take it around. Come on, United. Win the ball back. Here we go. Go on. Bruno Fernandes drops a shoulder. What are you doing, Bruno, you absolute rat? Get up, you fraud. Just because I want him to win, you know, I don't mean I'm going to put up with this sort of rubbish. What is that from Bruno? Oh, he kicked me. Ow. Ow. Get up. What sort of captain is he? I'm so glad that guy don't play for our football club, you know. Can't stand him. Oh, no. Here come Liverpool. Mo Salah. Go to the ball. They're in. Great save, Anana. And cleared off the slab of Maguire. 
What a save. Sabozai should have scored. Salah whips it in. Still could be there. It's cleared by Rashford. This could be a long day, people. I can't lie. This Man United team looks flaky, man. What is going on? They're playing counter-attack in a home game. Liverpool are dominating the ball. This is crazy. Robertson whips it in. Cleared by Maguire again. Big up Kamani. Hope you're well, bro. Salute to you and the family. Come on, United. Bro, this game's going to be hard to watch. What a save by Anana. Why is the defence? What a ball from Salah. So Bozlai in the area. Great save with the left hand of uh, Anana. Defence wide open. That's a great save, by the way. I can't believe that Man United play counter-attack at home. They're horrible. They can't control a game. They can't. They're going to have to hit them on the break. Bruno wins a free kick. Can't stand that guy. I really can't. I hope he scores, though. Endo brings down Bruno. Free kick um, inside the Man United half. Bruno fraud Nandez. You're not wrong, bro. Chaos already. They've carried on from the cup game. Their games are wild. Absolutely wild. They they just they have no control of the ball, do they, United? They're just literally trying to get some space and, and try and run at your defence. Luis Diaz. Good tackle. Come on, United. Ref, that should be a yellow card. Rashford got wiped out there. It's Casemiro. Rashi, get on with it. Stop moaning. Come on. Rashford's been wrote off there. He needs to recover quick. Come on. Come on, United. Good ball. That ref. Ref. Here's wan -Bissaka. Oh, he's got the worst technique you've ever seen. He didn't trust himself to shoot. United still have the ball. Big up everyone locked in. Shameless watch along. Ganacho looking for Kobe Mainu. Loses the ball. Good ball out wide. Come on, United. Dallo whips it in. Ah, it's not a great cross. Good tackle, though. Great tackle by Cam Camboala. But here come Liverpool on the break. It's Darwin Nunes. Mo Salah at the back post. Go to the ball, Maguire. Yes, Darwin Noodles slips over. And Maguire, Harry Beckenbauer comes away with the ball. Um, This is going to be a crazy game. You can just tell Man United are just a chaotic team, man. They're all over the place. Um, they have no control of the game. Liverpool just... Listen, the one thing, I'm looking at the game thinking, when we play them, we're going to hit them on the break like mad. Ezekiel, member for a month. Liverpool need to be careful of that high line they play. I hope they get done by the high line, bro. Rashford and them. Um, anything for Arsenal, says Planet Emmett. Exactly. What is that from Wambasaka? Here we go. No. Bruno Fernandes on the ball for United. Rashford in front of him. Here's Rashford. Gives it back to Bruno. Bruno finds Wambasaka. United keeping possession a bit more now. Come on. Create a chance. Pat does fitness currently in Washington, D.C. for the weekend. On um, at the Arsenal pub, Lou City. We're all with United today. Sending beer, love, big C. I hope you're well. Big up, bro. Big up all the Gunners in D.C. and in America, man. We're doing what's necessary. And it's a corner to Manchester United. Van Dijk puts it out for a corner. He's not happy. It's a yellow card as well. Is that a yellow card for Van Dijk? Get him sent off. No, it's Connor Bradley gets a yellow. Heavy challenge on um, Rashford. He wipes him out. Listen, Rashford, the right back is on a yellow card. He's a young player. You should be ripping him apart now, getting him sent off. Planet MSU said, I can't watch this crap. I'm just listening to you now. And Charles said, passion, guys, passion. We believe. Rat settings. That rat Bruno Fernandes. But hey, here we go. Fernandes whips it in. What an awful corner. It's headed out, though. Goes out for another corner. Come on. Can't be any worse than that one. Bradley on a, on a yellow card after seven minutes. Rashford, do your job. Come on, United. Corner again. Bruno whips it in. It's deeper. Flicked away. 
Comes out to the edge of the area, all the way back to the halfway line. Oh, Wamba Sako, absolute garbage. What did that guy say in that um, interview? He's like a fish riding a bike. Awful. And Anana pings it long. Could be in here. Oh, heads it back. Ganacho was nearly in. Anana is genuinely better on the ball than Wamba Sako. By miles as well, by the way. Wamba Sako technically is a conference player. National League. Horrific on the ball. Here's Bruno. That's a good ball. Rasmus Hoyland. Drive. Get wide, Ganacho. Is Ganacho in the area? Corner to United. Come on! United! 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 Come on! We got to do what's necessary, people. If we're lifting that Premier League trophy, this will all be worth it. Come on! Let's do this. Bruno Fernandes to take the corner. Put it on that slab head of Maguire and head it into the bottom corner. Let's go. Bradley's on a yellow card. Rashford, do your job. Here we go. Bruno Fernandes whips it in away. Swinger. Oh, he's headed away. And again, they're forced. Look at that from Wamba Saka. Mate, you should be playing another sport. You're so bad, it's unbelievable. Oh, he's absolutely dreadful. I can't with this guy. How do Man United fans put up with this guy? He can't kick a ball. Liverpool in possession. That Connor Bradley yellow card is um should be the green light for Rashford to go to work, man. You're playing against a fullback and you're playing out wide and he gets booked after seven minutes, bro. You should be causing problems. Good tackle there by Casemiro. Blocks Endo's pass, goes out for a throw-in. Streams getting deleted if Liverpool win, absolutely. Men in black settings, flash the light. You can't remember it, it never happened. United double their fan base in one day. You're not wrong. Brendan said, Curtis, I've bought, I've bought loads of Arsenal merch. This is the year. Here come Liverpool on the break. Darwin Nunes, you need to block it. Chips it to the back post. Salah on the volley. It's blocked. Goes out for a corner to Liverpool. Yeah, I've bought a lot of uh, merch this year. I can't lie. When your team's doing well, you're willing to spend money, right? Look at that again. Cobby Mayno, good ball in by Darwin. Volley from Salah blocked, goes out for a corner. I'd take a draw. I would take a draw because I don't believe in this Man United team. Um, I would take a draw, but I am hoping they get the win. But yeah, Lewis said, Big C got me and my daughter laughing so bad, bro. You're the best. Big up, Lewis and his daughter locked in. Corner whipped in, flicked on, comes back out to Mo Salah, edge of the box. He's unmarked. Oh, over the bar. Jeez. So Bosley, you cannot give him space like that to shoot. Whips it over the bar. Nelson said he had I had a fling at work. <laughs> Are you reading this? I don't know if he's on the wind up. Nelson said he had a fling at work with Wambasaka's mother-in-law. Come on, son. <laughs> if you're being honest there, that's unbelievable. I'm blaming you for his technique, bro. You should have taught him better. He can't kick a ball properly. You're a dis you're unbelievable, Nelson. Even if it's not true, it's a great one anyway. It's worth a it's worth a laugh on a Sunday. Liverpool in possession. Luis Diaz. Long way to go in this game. I don't feel comfortable watching this. Um, oh, listen, we're definitely supporting United today. It's difficult. I can't lie. Too easy, man. Just let you. They're just letting them get on the ball. Is Robertson. Liverpool dominate in possession. Maybe United are playing for a draw, but surely not at home. A draw is two points for us. You're right, Red Eye. You're right. A draw keeps us top of the league on goal difference. We'd be level on points, but we've got nine better goal difference than Liverpool, which is effectively another point. So we take it. That early yellow is definitely something to take advantage of. Exactly. They haven't got Trent on the bench. He's got Gomez on the bench. Wouldn't surprise me if they brought on Gomez at some stage for Bradley. But while he's on a yellow, Rashford, any time he gets the ball, should be on him. Liverpool in possession with Kelleher in his area. 
Clipped up field by Van Dyke, looking for Nunes. Maguire wins the header. Rashford is the key to this game for United. Oh, it's a ball here. Darwin Nunes looking for Diaz. Great block by Dallo. Goes out for a Liverpool corner. I have to admit, Man United's defence, man, on the break. Looks wide open. Where is your defence? Look at Maguire's recovery. He's running in cement. He can't get near him. Dallo, what a block. Diaz would have been one-on-one -on -one with a goalkeeper. Absolutely wide open. I'll tell you something. If they play like this, Arsenal will cut United. Nelson said it's the truth. She's a nurse at his hospital. That's crazy. Corner taken short for Liverpool. United don't look at it. They look a bit tired, man. Maybe that Chelsea game took a lot out of them. A draw is all we need from United. That puts the title in our hands. Uh, a win does does it without goal difference. Let's go, United. Here's Luis Diaz, left-hand side, up against Diogo Dallo. Liverpool dominating possession. Man United need to go back to basics. They do. LSU, you can't say recovery in the same sentence as Maguire. You're not wrong. If you have to pick between Ganacho or Hoyland, who are you picking? I'm not the biggest fan of Hoyland, you know. I'm not convinced by Hoyland yet. Um, I'll probably go Ganacho. Curtis, if a League Two club offered you this deal, would you accept £1,000 a week, £200 bonus? Of course. Happy with that. Grand a week, playing football. Happy days, bro. And you know what? I didn't make any prediction for this game. I just said, let's hope. Give me hope, Joanna. Give me hope. That's all it is. Look at Wamba Sako. Awful, awful footballer. Goal kick. We'll take that. Listen, the way this game's going, I'm just looking at this as start time wasted. Start time, walk to the goal kick. A draw might be all you're going to get out of this, United. So, walk and time waste. Joe, Joe said you made me Google Wamba Saka's mother. Oh, I think he said the mother-in-law, didn't he? Crazy. Wamba Saka, mate. Fair play to him. Fair play. I, I respect Wamba Saka for becoming a Premier League footballer with that lack of technical ability. You know, he's got them mad recovery challenges. He's a good athlete, but technically, wow. I can't imagine him in a, you know, in a, a technical session in training. Must be crazy. Uh, a draw is good for us too. Need Rashford to pull a world. He can't even get the ball at the moment. It's a Liverpool keep ball session. Here's uh, Virgil van Dijk at the back. He's playing in Timberland boots, bro, I think. Sonny, thank you for the super chat. One game at a time. We have seven. We have a harder seven last games than Liverpool and City. We need at least a draw. Do the right thing, United. Come on, do us a solid. Right, here we go. Here we go. Rasmus Hoyland, lift your head. Ganacho's free back post. You haven't lifted your head. And that's why I wouldn't want him at Arsenal. Running down blind alleys. Should have given that to Ganacho at the back post. Bruno, look at the state of this rat. Great tackle, Rashford. Finally, you're working hard. This guy, Bruno Fernandes and Juan Basako. There's no way I could do streams every week watching those two guys play football. I just couldn't. I just couldn't. I really couldn't. LSU said, okay, if it's truly necessary, I'll pay for United goals. There you go. Memberships for every goal. Big up LSU. Good tackle, Harry Maguire. That should be United's ball. Well done, Slabhead. Straight off Sabo's life, throw into United. Casemiro keeps possession. United growing into the game a little bit. Ball over the top. Bruno Fernandes. He spent more time on the floor. He's offside and get up, you rat! Absolute rat. Honestly, can't stand the guy. He's a yard offside, shouting and cursing at the ref. You're off, bro. What's wrong with you? I'm a foe, so how do I become a member? I'm a subscriber. I want to be part of it. It should offer you the option to join next to the subscribe button. If you're on an iPhone, sometimes you have to go on the desktop um, version of YouTube to be able to join, bro. I don't know why. It's something to do with iPhone, but hey, big up. Yeah, no McTominay in the squad today. Uh, Kelleher finds... Um, Kwanzaa, good player, this lad. Young player. Obi-Wan Basaka, bro. 
Ball over the top track. The runner. McAllister. Oh, no. Oh, it does well to hold him up there. Great tackle. Great tackle, Casemiro. Fernandez gives it away. What on earth is this guy doing? He's giving me more stress watching this than, than an Arsenal game. McAllister out wide. Robertson drills it in. Oh, what a miss. Should be 1-0 to Liverpool. Sabozlai puts it wide. Seven yards out. Ball bounces. Side foot volley. Great ball in from Robertson. Should be 1-0. The absolute state of this Man United team. Sabozlai, even behind him, Salah's unmarked. Where on earth is the marking? Look at Salah behind him. He's, he's waiting to just sweep it in with his left foot. They're terrible. Absolutely terrible. The enemy of my enemy setting says, Jude, you're not wrong, bro. Come on, Cobby Maynou, lift your head up. Rashford was in so much space then. Ref, give him the free kick. Liverpool will have possession. I just think United have got to work a bit harder, man. They're not, they're not like, they're not busy enough. Liverpool dominating possession. Two live streams in two days for C Unit. We are being spoiled. Listen, I, I said as soon as that international break finished, we're gonna get busier now. We're gonna get busier, that's for sure. Uh Tuesday, uh, we'll be doing Arsenal, of course, Bayern Munich. Uh Wednesday, I might even do PSG against Barcelona as well. Let's get active. Look at Bruno, you, my friend, are an absolute. I'd rather have Master Splinter out of the Ninja Turtles playing than this guy. At least he was a good rap. You know what I mean? He looked after the Ninja Turtles, Donatello and them, man. Look at the state of this guy. He gives the ball away 90% of the time. It's unbelievable. And Wamba Saka, I don't know what's in his football boots, but the ball just bounces off him. Oh, dear. Honestly. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Uh, I want Arsenal-Real Madrid semi-final. Listen, I'd just be happy to be in the semi-final. When you come into Tampa Bay, Florida settings, man. Who knows? I don't know, bro. Hopefully, I should I should be in America again this summer for the tour, but uh, I'm not sure if they're going to... Apparently, they're going to announce a third um, game as well. I know they're doing LA and um, Philly. Shot by Robertson. Drags it wide. Horrible shot. Goes out for a goal kick. Mitchell said Saeed watches Manu every season, requires a lot of strength. You know what it is? Like, obviously United fans, though, they've had a lot of good times back in the day, especially the slightly older fans. You know, United were, were a dominant force. Um, it happens, don't it? Under Wenger, we went nine years without, uh, without uh, a trophy, so it, it can happen. Mohamed said, uh, didn't give the 20 memberships after our win yesterday. Here it comes, though. Hey, big up. You legend, Mohamed. Thank you for the super chat. If you're locked in, make sure on your settings you are able to be given gifted memberships. I don't want people missing out because their settings aren't turned on. And he's a man of his word. Absolute legend. Big up, Mohamed. He's gifted 20 Curtis Shaw TV memberships. Big up all the new members who will be gifted the membership. Um, sure on tour part three will definitely be a vibe, my friend. I'll be running up them steps in Philadelphia like Rocky Balboa. Drago! It is all that's going to be going off. LA again as well. And uh, let's see where else they go. Come on, man! United aren't up. They're, they're getting bullied. Absolutely bullied there. McAllister brushes him off the ball. Luis Diaz pulls it back, blocked. They're just... They're, there's, a, there's a panic about United. It feels like, oh, ball over the top. Oh, good flick on. I thought Salah was getting that corner. United are hanging on here, people. They are hanging on. This is not good to watch. Just shows how good we are because I'm looking at Liverpool now. And they look good. And I'm thinking, we've played these twice. We've beat them once and drawn with them. So it shows how good we are. You know, but listen... Can they hang on? Can they hang on? And then create a chance themselves. We're rooting for you. It's crazy, Omar. Never thought it would happen. Corner to Liverpool. Whipped in. Free header. Goal. 
Luis Diaz scores. Andre Anana, you absolute fraud. They might as well have been in Manning goal. Yeah, I feel like it's game over. How does the goalkeeper not save that? He doesn't even hit it well, Diaz. Volleys it into the ground. They're a shambles, Man United. Free header at the start. Flicked on. He's unmarked six yards out. The guy's unmarked six yards. Who's marking him? Who is marking him? Anana. Darwin Nunes flick. Diaz unmarked. The only thing I'll say, it's a wet surface. It would have... Oh. Man United are awful. Absolutely awful. This is just... Uh, I'm here just purely for vibes and conversation now. Um... We may have to start talking about your favourite biscuits, your favourite rapper, and your favourite um, computer games growing up. I am not letting them ruin this Sunday. They're a joke of a football team. Absolute joke. Man United v Liverpool, this is the best you can offer. I just, I'm not going to allow them to stress me out. Curtis said they may as well have Beanie Manning. Bro, I'm telling you. Put Beanie Manning goal. He might have saved that. What the? Following... Crying emoji face, bro. It's been coming. Let's just focus on us. As I said yesterday, we're going to have to win seven out of seven. We ain't going to get no favor from no one. If anybody wants to start talking about biscuits, then, then keep it moving. Personally, I love the caramel digestives. Used to dip them in milk. They're elite. The caramel goes all soggy. It's an amazing biscuit. If you want to talk biscuits, then, then we can do it. I'm not what I'm not getting caught up in this rubbish. It's a load of nonsense. Um, favorite biscuits: chocolate hobnob said SFT. Shirley biscuit. Uh, problem is we need a favor from someone. Yeah, exactly. Because if they win seven out of seven, they win the league no matter what we do. Uh, imagine being Fergie. Oh, Fergie, mate. Uh, custard creams. Oh yeah, I've got to change the score. I was hoping it wasn't true. 1-0 to Liverpool, Luis Diaz, Darwin Nunes with the assist. Little flick on, unmarked. Classic chocolate digestive you're going with. Shortbread, good. Plain, but good. Custard creams were legendary back in the day. And growing up, you know, you could get them cheap. You could get a whole packet for like 60p. Um, so they were good. It's a corner to Liverpool. Robertson headed away this time. Edge of the box. Volley, it's up in the air. They're scrambling. Get rid of the ball, man. They're an embarrassment of a team. They might get pumped. They honestly could lose this heavily. Uh, Maryland Cookies. Ooh. 99p for the pack, man. It was good. Scottish all but a shortbread. Shortbreads were nice, weren't they, for a plain biscuit. Here come United. Can we end the biscuit chat? Give the ball to Rashford. Rashi, do something. No. Bruno, get off the floor, man. I mean, he wins a free kick. I'll let him off. Southern Guna, big up, Matt. How the mighty have fallen, y'all? Sure, this United ain't Oxford. Oh. It could be Oxford United we're watching. What I would say, I'm going to give my advice to every Arsenal fan in the chat right now. We all want United to win. Cool. Don't get caught up in this game. Because we had a great day yesterday as Arsenal fans. And... This game can become stressful if you get caught up in it. So, hope for the best, expect the worst. In my head, United are losing. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, what a chance. You're rubbish, Hoyland. Casemiro, was it, who headed it? Should have equalised. Casemiro. I mean, he tries to pass it. I'm not even listening to my own advice, am I? Calm down. I refuse to get caught up in this game. United are rubbish. I don't expect them to win. If they do, it's a bonus. Right, back to biscuits. Shirley biscuits, legendary. Sultana shortbread, says Patrick. Rich tea. I mean, rich tea is like basically... When you look back at a rich tea biscuit, 
it's basically sweet cardboard. Like, there's nothing really going on with a rich tea biscuit. Oh, come on, United. What you got? Bruno, do something. He's going to fall over. Hoyland, what are you doing? That is literally when you order Erling Haaland off Wish. It turns up five weeks later. It's made in China. And it's not real. Rasmus Hoyland, the absolute B-Tech um, Erling Haaland. Free kick to Liverpool. United are absolute trash. Canacho fouls. Free kick. Rubbish. I'm not the biggest fan of Oreos. You know why? Because is it not dark chocolate? I could be wrong. But it tastes a bit like dark chocolate. I like milk chocolate, you know. It's a bit sweeter, isn't it? It's a, yeah, Timu Haaland, man. It's going to take six weeks to turn up. And it ain't even real. Jaffa cake. Jaffa is a cake to avoid the biscuit tax. Chocolate rounds, decent. Panda Pops and Space Raiders. Bro, you could go shop when you was a kid with a pound. You came back with sweets, crisps, chocolate, drink, and you still might have had 15p change. Now, you go shop with a pound, you get a drink, and that's it. Darwin Nunes gets in. Cambuala recovers. Good tackle. Great tackle. Actually made a mistake there. He's applauding the fans. Turn around, brother. You ain't won the game yet. What's wrong with this Kawhi Leonard lookalike? Man's applauding the fans like you've won the game. You made the mistake in the first place. All you did is clean up the mistake you made in the first place. Looking like Kawhi Leonard playing for the Clippers. I don't know what's wrong with this guy. Turning around applauding the fans like he's just scored a hat trick. It's madness. Have United got N? Oh, oh, they're so bad. It's unbelievable. They are so bad. This is this is wild. But anyway, party rings were good back in the day. I can't lie. You go shot with a pound now. You'll be lucky to get a drink. Snickers is about 80p by itself. Tim Tams. Mario said, you're making me get up and raid the cupboard. I'm not watching this issue. Turn it off, bro. Turn it off. Get it off. Tempe Giant Cola. I mean, listen, by the way, I'm not trying to promote unhealthy food here. You know, health is wealth. Health is key. But, you know, we're just reminiscing. We're reminiscing. You used to get a Tempe mix. You just get anything in there, but it was always great. You know, good Tempe mix of sweets. Um, you can't get none of that no more. Bro, he's looking like Kawhi Leonard. I thought he was playing for the Clippers. Man turned around started applauding the fans. I thought he'd scored a hat trick. BMBM. BMBM. Remember them old school adverts, man? Where's all the adverts at, man? This ain't really the correct climate to be bringing up Cadbury's chocolate fingers. Yeah, no diddy. But they're a shout. Anyone remember McVitie's hazelnut boosters? I can't remember them. Yeah, chocolate fingers in the modern day. You know, you do have to say pause, no diddy after that. But yeah, I remember. I'm going weekend league. I don't blame you, bro. Although, you know, that can be stressful as well. But go and play EFC, man. Try and get elite for the weekend. I'll tell you what's not elite. This Man United team. They wouldn't even finish in silver. They're a shambles. You're a Man U fan. I mean, you, it's hard to support this nonsense. I'm wasting my time here. Frank Lampard has emerged as a surprise candidate to take charge of Canada's national team. I apologise for everyone in Canada in advance. When you see Frank Lampard as manager, you know what I mean. Maryland Cookies, legendary. Jammy Dodgers, I haven't had them for years. They were good. You need to watch UFC next week, and I don't really watch UFC that much, you know. Rangers felt it was a great game. It was. Champar said, I turn the game off, I'll be playing EFC. I actually don't blame you. Lock the game off. Tuck shot back in the day, man. Listen, I used to go community centre every Monday. Indoor football, pool, table tennis, and basketball. And then tuck shop. Take your little pound. Sweets. Yo, I don't know what's going on nowadays. Does anybody actually do that anymore? Like, going community centre and that. I don't think them things even happen anymore. When do you do a new podcast with Kev? I'm going to ask him. I, oh, Bradley's been cooked there by Rashford. Just foul him. Oh, they've recovered, they've recovered too quick. They've recovered too quick. It's gone already. <laughs> the 
The ball's like a hot potato for United, honestly. It's like the temperature goes up when they're on the ball. Kobe Mainu gets wrapped. Liverpool on the break. Five against three. They're swarming. They're swarming forward. It's like a pack of orca whales in the ocean. Salah shoots. Saved by an honor. Tips it wide. This is horrible. This is... I, I'd, I'd just rather talk about sweets and biscuits and reminisce over the good days. Fruit winders are great sweets. Penguin biscuits, man. Rocky bars, they were good as well. Penguin or a club, if you like a lot of chocolate in your biscuit, join our club. Remember them old school adverts? Uh, oh, Tuck Shop biscuits, not the actual Tuck Shop. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, they were nice biscuits. Cheesy biscuits, weren't they? Um, corner to Liverpool. Robertson whips it in. It's in the air. Back post, Salah. You know, their best player unmarked. Curls it. An honour. Like, are you being serious, bro? Can you not catch that? Has he got margarine on his on his gloves? Salah's floated that. Catch it. What's going on? This guy's a shambles. I never like wagon wheels, you know. I don't know why, Zach. Too mushy inside. I didn't, and I, I didn't really like him. Wasn't a big fan. Anana, bro. This guy. Palming the ball out. Straight at him. Oh! Free header cleared. Man United are scrambling. So Bosley goes past two. Darwin Nunes inches over the bar. Goal kick. Let's talk about sweets and chocolate. Curly Whirlies. Oh my days. What an elite chocolate. I think they're about 15p. The amount of mess that you made, man. The chocolate would all crumble off. The caramel was elite. You had the fudge, you had the chomp, and you had the curly whirlies. Opal fruits, bro. The fact you called them opal fruits, you've gone up in my estimation. Don't turn up with Starburst. Let's respect them for what they were. You go in the shop, you ask for opal fruits, fam. Not Starburst. Elite, bro. Elite. What a sweet they were. Crunchy bar as well, damn. They were good. Freddo, bro, Freddo's 10p. They ain't been 10p for years. They're about they're about a hundred pound now. Nah, they, they're crazy now. Freddo's are like 30p. That's when you know inflation is real, man. Freddo's are about 30p, bro. Fizzy chew it, so all fruit pastels. You know, I I might have to go shop after this, spend about a tenner. Here come Liverpool! Ball whipped in! Salah! Oh, he volleys it over the bar. Klopp's fuming. Because Klopp knows it should be game over. It should be game over. Liverpool training session. United are absolute. They bet. Yeah. The only thing I'm looking at, United better play like this when we play them. Honestly. Play like this, please, when we play them. I don't know how United are even. Um, or even in a Europa League spot. Just put them out of their misery. You're right, Dre. Just just end it. Just end it. Surely they got something to fight back. Oh, cola cubes, man. I mean, this... Like, you know now you get older and you start checking the amount of sugar in things and you want to eat healthier and that. Can you imagine how much sugar is in them? But they were elite, bro. They were so nice. Fruit salads as well. They were a great one. Uh, tuck shop and youth centre as my youth centre was a family of rowdy bowd who used to play pool, watch movies, eat curly whirlies. Happy days, man. Mohammed said, bruv, this is really difficult to watch. I'm just here for the community vibe alone. Listen, it's Sunday, day of rest, relax. Don't let this stress you out. In your head as an Arsenal fan, just say that Man United are going to lose. And if they get anything out of it, we'll celebrate it shamelessly. They're a shambles. I'm not going to let them stress my Sunday up. I watched Arsenal yesterday. We did our thing. Oh, Rashford, you're running off the pitch, bro. It's a throw into Liverpool. They're a shambles. Leave Goldbridge and all them lot. Let them lot stress about this shambolic team. I'm not going to worry about them. Marathon Bar, they were good. Um, what else we got? Blackjacks or fruit salad? I preferred fruit salad. I want blackjacks. Were they licorice? I don't like licorice. I don't like them. How beast, big C, what happened to Anana? He was good when Nottingham got promoted to the Premier League. Anana, oh, no, nah, that was um, 
Who was that in goal for um, Forrest? Samba. You're mixing up Samba. Samba's at Lons now, I think. Um, he's doing well there. He's in the French squad as well. Bro, peer drops. Oh, my days. I haven't seen a lot of these sweets for years. I might have to go shop and, and spend about... Remortgage the house just to get these sweets. But yeah, they were malted milks, man. They were good as well. Twix is still elite, said SFT. Yorkie, Lion Bar, Kinder Surprise. Tizer. Remember them old school drinks? Tizer. I don't see them. Tizer and... What else did you have, man? There was... Lilt, Iron Brew, all them old school drinks. There was all sorts. White bonbons. Used to live off cans of R10 and Lion chocolate bars. It was mad, innit? Mars bar is the worst chocolate, said um, Legend of Renegade. Having a Kit Kat right now, says Tactics. Oh, uh, dear. Millions, someone said. Them little sweets. Quattro. I remember. Lil K.A. K.A. Black Grape. Oh, look at that from Maguire. Awful. Do you see Gwen Doozy and Dybala fight? Dybala showed him his shin pad, which had Argentina winning the World Cup. I seen that. I seen that. Gwen Doozy. It was, was it Lazio Roma? Skittles or... Yeah, they'll always be a solid one. They'll always be solid. Shrimps, yeah. It's just... We're just talking about sweets. Forget the game. Every time I look up, um, Liverpool have got the ball. I'm actually not interested in the game. Hubba Bubba. Chewing gum. Bubble gum. Uh, nah, Curtis uh, was driving home and you're talking about biscuits while I'm fasting. Oh, apologies, everyone fasting. This ain't helping. Sour Skittles. Apologies to anyone fasting. I'm not helping. Giant jawbreakers. Oh, they were mad. peanut M and M's. I might just go shop at half time. Just do ASMR on the on the stream. Beer bottle sweets. They're old school. They were. weren't they expensive? Um, there is an injury here to Luis Diaz. I think there'll be a break in possession. Shots are thirteen zero. It's pathetic. It's a perfect Everton mints. You know they're the kind of sweets you get when you would go to like your granddad's house or something. Mint humbugs or Everton mints, you know. Uh, they're showing the goal back. Caramel covered Brussels sprouts. E Ross, I've never heard of them, bro. They sound crazy. Runts. Ice cream screwball. Ah. Oh. With the bubble gum at the bottle at the bottom, legendary, absolutely one bars. Oh my days! I don't know if I could eat one of them nowadays. I think they just rip your teeth out. When you're a kid, you're like a you're like a pit bull dog when you're eating them things, man. One bar, man. Them bars were crazy. About ten p, they would literally rip your teeth apart. But they were great, man. There was a few others as well. Oh, an honor on the ball. United can't get out their own off. They really can't. There's Harry Maguire. Werther's original. They were good as well. That's another like sweet you'd get at your granddad's house. Hey, Khaled, you might need a timeout for that. He said Diddy Sweets. That's an outrageous comment. <laughs> oh, dear. It's wild. Ball over the top. Oh, Rashford. Liverpool could be in. Dumb is it. Diaz, what a block. Corner should have been 2-0. United are so bad. Didn't even want... I couldn't believe... I thought you was trolling me, Ross. Refresher bar should have been illegal. Can you imagine the sugar that's in them things? Nowadays, I don't think I could even eat them things, but... Choc ice. That was a quality um, chocolate ice cream, man. Curtis, new food review chat. That's all we are. That's all we can talk about. United haven't had a shot in the game. What's I, what am I supposed to tell you here, people? We're here to watch United win. They haven't had a shot. Ball whipped in, headed away at the near post. 
You'd think you was watching Liverpool against Sheffield United the way Man U are playing. They're hanging on to just not get annihilated. Casemiro finds Bruno Fernandes. How long until he gives the ball away? There you go. Oh, my... Atrocious. Wambasako. They are so bad. Uh, here come Liverpool again. Salah whips it in. Oh, Nana gets it. Every time Liverpool attack, they look like they're going to score. Wamba Saka. Oh, I respect it. I respect it. You mix the, you know, the sweet conversation and the... And the... Um, nerds. Yeah, I remember them sweets as well. Come on, man. Show some fight. It's United against Liverpool. Come on. Look at the state of Bruno. Don't get angry, don't you? In through the nose, out through the mouth. Woosa, woosa. Bruno couldn't pass wind, I'm telling you. Someone should grab Bruno around the throat and say, what the hell are you doing? Why can't he pass the ball to a Man United player? Rashford was in then. He, it's an easy pass. Sun lollies. Sunny delight. Remember that drink? California and Florida version. Kinder Bueno. I can't believe how bad Bruno Fernandes is on the ball. It's unbelievable. Cookie Chris was banned in Canada. Gummy beers. Ah, my gummy beer. Yes, ah, my gummy beer. All right, th this, at, the, at the moment, this is a coping mechanism to get through this game. It's that bad. Man United haven't had a shot. And we're here for them to try and win. Ball over top. What's that? Where's the defence? I genuinely think Bruno's given the ball away every time he's tried to play a, a decent pass. They're so bad. They can't keep the ball for more than two passes. They're so, so bad. Here come Liverpool. Darwin plays a 1-2. Oh, he should have scored. Offside flag goes up anyway. Wouldn't have counted. Alexander said, I love your passion for the game. Big up, bro. Listen. Whatever's necessary for Arsenal, we got to do it. Jelly Tots, oh, they were nice. Covered in sugar, Oof, they were good. Big up JW. Uh, Halcyon said, looks like that rat Fernandez has had one too many wham bars. <laughs> Bro, you're not wrong. He might need a wham bar to give him some energy. Uh, and Jude said, Saka needs to understudy Salah and learn. Well, he's a good player to learn from, and he? he's kind of the master of that. Right wing, left footer in the Premier League. Feast ice cream. Panda Pops, 25p. They were brilliant. Best G-Unit album. Did, did they have? Beg for Mercy. Is, I didn't even know they had another album. I thought that was the only one. Look at Dallo. Gets pickpocketed by Diaz. Please don't concede. Minute till half time. They're stretched. It's a boss light. Oh, what a block. I don't know how United are, are actually only losing 1-0. They have been absolutely annihilated in this game. They're so bad. It's unbelievable. I'm pretty sure Liverpool must have had 60-odd. 56% possession. How can you, in 45 minutes at home, not have a shot on or off target? No shots. Like, if you get the ball 45 yards out, you might as well just shoot just to get the stats up. It's crazy. It's crazy. Munchies were good. Corner whipped in. It's cleared. Come on. Just blow the whistle, ref. They need an, they need some Lucas aid. One of the worst 45 minutes I've ever seen from Bruno Fernandes. Half-time whistle goes. I'm actually thankful that United are only 1-0 down because they should be 3 or 4-0 down now. They are awful. Absolutely awful. Liverpool should be 4 0 up. United are horrific. So bad. 
I've spent half the first half talking about biscuits and old school sweets. They are horrific. They don't look interested. And this was always my worry. I said, if Man United get beat by Chelsea, they've got no real possibility of finishing fifth or, or fourth, which could get them a Champions League spot. They, these players, your Casemiro's, your Rashford's, your Bruno's, your 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 Maguire's, well, not even Maguire, your Varane's, those guys are not going to be motivated by trying to get a Europa League spot. They've down tools. They've down tools. They're on the beach. Them man there are thinking about the Euros and where they're going to spend the summer in the Bahamas or the Maldives. They're not bothered. The only positive from this game is it's 1-0. Because if they go 2-0 down, we might as well lock the stream off. 1-0, you've always got an outside chance of doing something. I mean, who've they got on the bench? I mean, Mason Mount maybe? I don't know. I don't know. It's crazy. Bruno isn't captain material. Uh, Peppermint said Casemiro is a clown for kicking the ball out of Subby's clock. Um, Fernandez is so overrated. He's, he's dreadful. Casemiro is like a 48-year-old, says Jim. Are we playing United at the Emirates or Old Trafford? Old Trafford, I'll tell you one thing. If they play like this against us, 4-5-0. But you guarantee they won't. I can guarantee they won't. They'll, they'll play better than this for some reason. No shots. Zero shots. At home in 45 minutes. Is a joke. They've been their attack has been non-existent. Absolute. They've got nothing. Tell me, call what well, cake sell crisps in a second? No. Listen, I'm hoping people we can actually talk football in the second half. I actually had to use a way out from what I was watching. Believe me, I'm only here today to see United try and take points off Liverpool, right? For the sake of Arsenal, that's the only reason I'm here. After 15 minutes, I said, I need a coping mechanism to get me through this game. We're going to have to talk about old school chocolate sweets and crisps. And it got us through the half. I was reminiscing about all sorts of, um, you know, classics we used to get from the shop. The game is pathetic. I don't know how Man United fans are coping with that. I'm hoping we can watch some decent football in the second half. Mazo said, Curtis, you lot will beat United comfy. Because we're playing them second to last game of the season... I just hope they're done by then and they're not interested because they look like they've down tools today. Garnacho's the only good attacker they have. I don't really rate um, Hoyland. Rashford's temperamental, isn't he? H said, Milky Way, crispy rolls, they are good. When you lot finish the stream, you're just going to go shop and buy loads of sugar, aren't you? Don't do it. We're not trying to promote diabetes, people. Trust me. We're just, you know, we're reminiscing on the good times. When we just used to go shop and life was simple. Go shop with a pound. You come back with a carrier bag full of stuff. Um, now you probably just get the carrier bag for a pound. That's it. Um, Ten Hag will say later we dominated. Ten Hag will be like, listen, just lost 4-0 to Liverpool. But why didn't we get that penalty back in October when Gabriel pulled him? You know, he's, he keeps talking about us. TV1, I'm planning on gym this afternoon, but all this sweet talk is testing me. Fight for it, people. I'm not promoting any of this, by the way. I'm not. Healthy living is the best way forward. Eddie Abu settings, man. Um, but yeah, man, it was good to reminisce. Anyway, I can't believe the numbers. 3,000 of you locked in. The community is goated. Goated community, as simple as that. You're the messy of um, communities, people. Um, Lionel Messi, not Messi as in a mess. You know what I meant, anyway. Uh, 47 of you on Twitch as well. Big up. Hit the like button, subscribe. What can I say about that first half? Man United didn't have a shot. Not on target or off target. Nothing. They decided they don't want to attack. How can you not just have a shot 30 yards out, just have a pop shot? Anything can happen. Liverpool, four shots on target, six shots off target. 58% possession, eight corners, absolute, total, and utter dominance. This was a crazy game of football. Um, 
Coach, remember them six aside tournaments, play a match, then get a panda pop, then a burger. Hey, uh, back in the day. Not the Ronaldo. No, not Ronaldo. Oh, R9 Ronaldo, maybe. Not CR7. I rate CR7, but Messi's, you know, Messi's ended that argument. When Messi lifted that World Cup, that argument ended. You know, people used to say all the time, oh, Messi or Ronaldo. As soon as Messi lifted the World Cup, just stop the argument. End it, delete it, don't even speak it. It's done. It's dusted, mate. He's finished it. He's won it. Most Ballon d'Ors, World Cup winner, game over. You know, simple. But hit the like button, people. Hit the like button. Happy Sunday. Hope you're all well. They're showing you the Liverpool goal now. I don't know what they're doing. I don't know what they're doing. Kobe Mainu. Uh, the thing is, are they? So, it looks like they're man-to-man -man marking. So Kobe should have gone with Diaz. He left him. Doesn't go with him. Flicked on by Darwin. Wambasaka's nowhere near him. It's a shambles of a goal. Ronaldo does have a, a, a Euro Cup. Yeah, but Euro ain't the world. No shots. No shots on target. Zero XG. No shots on or off target. Um, I suppose, do you know the only positive, right? The only positive for United is that they can't play any worse than that, surely. Surely there has to be a reaction in the second half. You can't be as bad as that. And they haven't got Europe in the week. You know, Liverpool have got um, Atalanta in the Europa League. So they may want to change things as the game goes on. But Ten Hag doesn't have that excuse. Infused sweets will get one through the game, um, says Phil. Vegas Gunner. Uh, wish we had been more attacking versus City. Some of their starters were missing, but hope is for... Yeah, listen. I said after the game, some people thought I was harsh, but I thought we could have attacked City more, considering they had no Edison, no Walker, no Stones. Ake came off injured, but it is difficult. You know, and if Trossard rolls it, Martinelli maybe scores, but was he onside anyway? Second half coming up after the break. Get yourself ready, people. It ain't going to be easy. Sean Dyke's team talk. Listen, mate, if I was Man United manager, it's as simple as that. The first thing I'm doing, mate, I'm doing the check hook. Remember the check hook, what uh, Mayweather did to Ricky Atten? I'm check hooking that rat-faced Bruno right on his nose. I'm knocking his two front teeth out. I'm subbing him off. He'll never play for this club again, mate. He's an absolute disgrace. I'll bring myself on in midfield. I'll show some pride, some passion. And I'll just two-foot Mo Salah, mate. You know what I mean? So, make me the manager. We'll win the game. Sean Dyche, legend, ginger genius. Um, HR said, expectation always leads to disappointment. To be honest, don't see Liverpool dropping points. They will win the Premier League. Focus should be on the Champions League. I'm not sure, you know. I think Liverpool will drop points. They've been fantastic today. I can't lie. But... I do think they might drop points. I think City might go unbeaten. Um, but listen, you could be right. Liverpool could go unbeaten as well. I mean, looking at their fixtures, let's have a look. Catalanta at home, that's Europa League. Palace at home, I think they'll win that. Fulham at home, no, Fulham away. I think mm, Fulham are unpredictable. I think Liverpool will beat them. Everton away is their derby game, but Everton aren't great. Probably Liverpool. See, the tricky spell is here, right? They've got West Ham away, Tottenham at home, Villa away, and, oh no, Wolves at home. That's easy. So their tricky spell is there at the end of April, start of May. West Ham away, Tottenham at home, and Villa away. I think they'll drop points in one of those games. Even a draw. Even a draw. Um... I'm trying not to concentrate on Man City too much because the reality is we're ahead of Man City on the same game. So if we do our job, we shouldn't need to focus on Man City for the rest of the season if we can win seven out of seven. But Liverpool is the problem because if they win their next seven games and win today, they're champions regardless of what we do. But all we need is a draw. I think they'll draw with someone. You look at Liverpool this season, 30 games, 7 draws, 2 defeats. 
So they've dropped points in nine games out of 30, nearly one third of their games. I think they will drop points somewhere, at least a draw. Uh, Big C, read my comments, says Jay and Gigi. Big up, bro. There you go. It's been read. Uh, we could have got a bit more, really, in the comment, but hey. Um, we have to win out, says MLK. We might need to. Let's get the likes up. Can we get 2,000 likes, people? Let's do a like check. Listen, I was only looking for a, um, a big name strike. Yeah, you're right. We do need a big stri uh, a big name striker next year. Um, there was no like uh, target. Probably a thousand, but now now you're here. You might as well you might as well get to two thousand just for vibes. Bring that good look, people. We're at a thousand pretty much anyway. So yeah, you've done great today, people. Big up. If we can get near two thousand, then great. Big C, have you got any dogs or pet? No pets, man. No pets. I did have a dog when I was younger, but as you get older, man, when you got kids is enough. Having dogs, you know, having to feed them, take them to the vets, clean up, dog hairs around, take them for walks. I do like dogs, but it's just adding more more work, you know. Uh, sniper scope have Paul been that good or United that bad I think a combination of the two they've completely just dominated the game their finishing is the one thing that's let them down big up sniper and ghost Nath said we just need to win all our games which isn't easy by the way which is definitely not easy um cats or dogs I do prefer dogs over cats cats are a bit more mysterious aren't they I always look at cats and think yeah, they look like they just attack you one day and just scratch you for no reason. Um, I'd go with a dog. You can see you got to get a Don Kai. Yeah, well, we've got a pet, mate. Don Kai Havertz. Um, that's our, that's a Arsenal fans' pet, you know, the, the donkey. Don Kai. Um, Vinay said, Big C, tandoori roast chicken in the oven, roast potatoes in as well. Watching the game, listening to your legendary stream. I mean, what a Sunday. What a Sunday, my friend. Dinner's in there. The game's on. You're listening to the stream. Big up for commenting. Enjoy the dinner. I'm just hoping United give us something to feast on in this game, people. Because right now, we're starving. Um, you have to work for the affections of cats. Jack Burns meets the parents. Oh, but yeah, I hear that. Um, you know, they say cats are more loyal than dogs. Yeah, but yeah, maybe... maybe um, they're a lot more independent, aren't they, as well? Game will end 1-1. Listen, Adam, I would take that all day long right now. Every single day of the week. Where have you travelled in the world? Lots of places, man. Fortunate, very fortunate. Caribbean, a few islands in the Caribbean. America, a number of places in America. All around Europe. I've never been Australia. I've never... Never done a flight um, that distance. I've never been anywhere, Australia or New Zealand or anything like that. But yeah, man. It's like watching Norwich um, to get a draw in this game. They're that bad. It's strange, isn't it? You know how if they'd have beaten Chelsea, you'd have probably been watching a different Man United today. Confidence is difficult to gain and easy to lose. That's the crazy thing about confidence in football. You can lose it very quickly. But to gain it is difficult. Liverpool got a good victory in midweek. And uh, they don't look like anything's bothering them. Um, United look wounded from what happened at Chelsea. And that's, that's the thing. Uh, we just need to win all our games. Have I read that one? I think I read that one. All right, the players are back on the pitch, and somehow Bruno Fernandes is still out there after dropping a disaster class. Cats are not loyal. They switch allegiance uh, real quick when it comes to food. Caleb said, yeah, that fixture knocked the wind out of them, all that was left at least. Snake Eye said, United is horrible. Liverpool should be three goals up. Um, be back in a bit. Actually, walking my dogs now. Hey, big up E Ross. I expect you to get the headphones on. Stay, stay tuned in. Listen in, bro. While you walking the dogs. Now you got to listen out in case your dog starts going crazy, having a fight or something. Um, big up Grant Socks who said, uh, "My new fan from Canada. Big fan of the channel. I come for the real toy. That's what yo. Listen, that's what we are here, people. We're gonna talk the things, people. You know what I mean? We ain't gonna. We ain't gonna." Um, cover up 
and uh, and and dress it up. We're going to get the real talk. And anyway, it don't get more real than this second off. Oh, Man United going to do something, please. That first half was painful, and I'm not even a fan of United. But for obvious reasons, I wanted a decent performance. They're attacking the Stretford end. Liverpool to get us back underway in the second half. Dominic Sabozlai to kick off. Uh, Ten Hogs just coming out. What's going on with this guy? They're about to get... Stop clapping the fans, bro. They don't rate you. They said you look like a boiled egg. And they're going to sack you in the summer. There we go. We're underway. Second half's underway. Ten Hogs trying to be a cheerleader. And uh, the game is underway. I should gift that Man United fan a membership, said Snake Eyes. Big him up, man. And Abisham said uh, Aston Villa will play on Thursday against Lip. That's a great point. I saw that yesterday. Villa play in the Conference League on Thursday. We play in the Champions League on Tuesday. We play Aston Villa on Sunday. So we've got, you know, 48 hours more recovery time. Ball over the top. Jeez, United already scrambling. I suppose the only argument you could say, despite the 48 hours more recovery, we're playing Bayern Munich. They're playing Lille. You know, their game is probably going to be a lot easier than our game. So, but hey, it is what it is. Uh, Liverpool in possession. McAllister spins Bruno Fernandes. He can't get anywhere near him. He's given up. He's, he's running rings around him. Drops Casemiro to the floor. Here's Salah. Rolls it into... Um, that's got to be offside. And it's a goal kick to Manchester United. Drifter bar. I used to like them, you know. I haven't seen them for years. Um, nah, no WrestleMania, bro. As I said, I haven't watched wrestling since WWF. I'm old school. Come on, United. Yeah, United. Yeah, United. Yeah, United. Just a scrappy draw, man. I ain't even got the confidence they can win, but just a draw. We'll take that. Throw into United. In the Liverpool half. Timothy said, hey, Big C, when Man United play, play our Gunners, God bless from Timmy. Blaze and Gunner Paul, Arsenal for life since 72, 73. Respect. Uh, United are smelly, bro. Yeah, that's an understatement. They stink. Uh, here come United. Come on. At least, oh, my days. They're so bad. Cobby gives the ball away. Here come Liverpool. They literally turn a Man United attack into a Liverpool attack in seconds. Liverpool in the area. Robertson whips it in. Maguire miss kicks it. Darwin Nunes is blocked. Wow, United get away with it. Casemiro! Get rid of the damn ball, you old man. Go on, Rashi, lad! Go on! Skin him! He's on a yellow! Take him on! You're rubbish! Rashi, you're not rubbish! Oh, cross it, he loses it. Why does he not cross the ball with his left foot? He's trying to twist and turn. That is such a poor decision from Rashford. Gets past Bradley. Cross it with your left foot, man. Canacho's unmarked at the back post. It's Kobe Mainu. United still have possession. Ref, get out of the way. It hits the ref. What is Rashford doing there? He outpaces Kobe Mainu. Kwanzaa comes over. Ganacho's free at the back post. He tries to then turn back and take him on again and loses the ball. Trying to show off, bro. Just cross the damn ball in. You're rubbish. You're not rubbish. Hey, listen. No, uh, any con I won't even apologise for any comments today because it ain't our team anyway, so I don't care. It was so bad. You did the first bit right. HR said, watching your stream and not the game, you should travel. If AFTV do an India or Southeast Asia or Australia tour, listen, definitely would love to. Definitely would love to. I was actually hoping this year Arsenal went somewhere different as well. Okay, maybe they go America, but then maybe they go Asia, maybe they go Australia, go somewhere else. But same old, innit? They're making so much money off the US tour. They're going to do the whole tour in, in America, which I don't mind at the same time because I do enjoy America. But I thought they might have maybe gone America for a bit and then gone somewhere else. But I think because of the Euros, there probably isn't time to go elsewhere as well. So, uh, Trashy, Marcus Trashford. Bruno Fernandes having one of the worst games I've ever seen, honestly. I'm not even uh, exaggerating. He's been horrific. 
Come on! Ah! Ah! Bruno Fernandes! You're unbelievable! I've always rated you! He's lobbed the goalkeeper from 45 yards out! He's world class! Bruno Fernandes, the rat face assassin, equalizers for Manchester United. What a player! He's world class, he's legendary, he's iconic. And he looks like a rat out of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Master Splinter with an unbelievable equaliser. Manchester United won. Liverpool won. Wow. Kwanzaa turns back. Gives it to Bruno. He lobs the goalkeeper from 45 yards out. Bruno, what a goal. I've always rated him, honestly. I've said it before and I'll say it again. He's world class. He's absolute world class. What a player. He's had a great game today. He really has. Every pass has found his player. He's been, a, he's been sensational. Man of the match. Listen, in all seriousness, that, that's a hell of a finish. That is a hell of a finish, by the way. That's unbelievable. Master splinter equalizers. Come on, United, let's do this. Come on, Rashi, now. Wake up, lad. Go on, Ra go on, Hoyland. you got to work harder than that. Come on. They can win it now. Get that strip for them making noise. Hun yes, Kobe Mainu, lad. Come on. Rattle the Scousers now. Uh-oh. Three on three. Why are they so open at the back? Don't let him do that, young buck. Yes! Yeah, free kick. Well done. Kawhi Leonard there with some great defending. I'm just calling him Kawhi Leonard because I keep... What's his name? Kambuala. Great defending. I was literally just saying he's having one of the worst games I've ever seen. I look up and he shoots and scores from 45 yards. He's had one of the worst games I've ever seen. Give him man of the match. People saying, park the bus. Listen, I want the winner. I want the winner. Your shame should be studded. Listen, just embrace it, Daniel. Honestly, be shameless and embrace it. Don't hide from it. What is that? Come on! Come on, United! Let's go! they got numbers forward. Cobby, give it to Rashi. Give it to Rashi! Rashi, come on. Take him on. Knuckleball! No! no! Come on. They've still got it. Casemiro needs an overlap. Needs something. Ganacho deflection corner. Yeah! Yeah, I said. Yeah, I said. Yeah, I said. Come on. Let's do this. Corner to United. Your little scream before you cheered someone. Clip it. You know what? Half the time I look back, you cut. You don't even know why you made that noise. Why you said that. You just got to just keep it moving, don't you, people? The Rat King strikes again. You're shameless. Master Splinter settings, bro. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Um, Come on. Corner to United. Straight on his slab. Slab it! Oh! He doesn't make good contact. Here's Rashford. Back post. Come on, Rashi, lad. Whips it in. Ah! Yo! Saved by Kelleher and cleared. Oh! They could have scored. Come on! Yeah, and I said... Yeah, and I said, yeah, and I said, how have you not scored that, Casemiro? How does he not get a touch on that? Kelleher palms it out. Should have been 2-1. Come on. Let's do this. Sam Bond, the timing on that, Kurt. Can you please keep trashing United players? We need them to win. Corner taken short. It's a terrible corner. Ganacho. No! They're getting hit on the break. No! They're swarming them. Come on. Go ball. No. Diaz, no. Yes. Darwin Noodles puts it wide. Yes. What a miss. How did Liverpool not score? It was five on two. I don't know how they haven't scored there. Bruno took the Curtis slander personally. I respect it. United's defence, please defend like that against Arsenal. 
You will get annihilated. Darwin at the back post. I don't. I think he's trying to pass that. There's no one there, bro. I don't know who he's passing to. Central C, aka Darwin Noodles. Corner to Liverpool, though. Robertson whips it in, headed away at the near post. Now the game comes to life. Come on, United. What you got? Kobe Mainu. You're going to lose it, fella. Ah, good tackle there by uh, McAllister. Where's your midfield? Sabozlai. Good tackle. Game's wide open now. It's like a basketball game. Liverpool's still the dominant team, but at least United have got uh, an attack now. Ref gets in the way again. I think they have to do a drop ball for that. Game's come to life all of a sudden. At 1-0, it was finished. Um, the fact that he can do that is the reason we say he's a fraud. Exactly. If you're talent level, you're capable of scoring from 45 yards out. What have you been doing? You can't even play a simple 10-yard pass. No more sweets chat. No, it's all been noted, people. We know what, what sweets we like. Liverpool on the attack again. Corner once again. Jeez, man. Carasso Mega said, uh, press the likes, peeps. My man Curtis is hella hyped up for our title charge. Big up, bro. Fabrica tour two minutes ago. I wrote to a man you fan. I can't pull up with Bruno every week. Now this wrong psychology, says Fabrica. Maybe we inspired him to, for greatness, you know? Maybe we inspired him. Corner to Liverpool, whipped in, headed away. Casemiro comes out to the edge of the box. Sabozlai. So Richard Fairburn, classic content right now, Big C. Big up, bro. If they lose this, I'm deleting this stream. This can't be online. If they win, it's worth every single bit of shamelessness. Here come Liverpool. Oh, no, don't name shoot. Darwin, shots blocked. Headed away. They can't get out. Good tackle, Kobe Mainu. Ah, Liverpool. Yeah. Come on, United. Ganacho. Good ball. Bruno, no, no, he's give it away again. See, his passing's been dreadful. He can't pass the ball, man. Liverpool do like these end-to-end -end games because Klopp sets his team up to high press. They're just constant. Uh-oh, here's Bradley. It's a chance. Mo Salah, don't foul him. McAllister, great block. Yes, they managed to get rid of it. They are hanging on. Rasmus Hoyland has done absolutely nothing in this game, by the way. Non-existent. Dean Burkett said, uh, Kurt, Big C, you're a proper legend. And you have and are making my Sunday pure poetry. Come on, you gunners. Maybe, man, you. Big up, bro. Big up. Appreciate your um, kind words. White Glove said, McAllister, what a player. Yeah, listen, for 35 million, it's a bargain. It is a bargain. Now, you know it's good. Klopp is going mad at the fourth official, which is always good. Grinding them teeth together and going crazy. You always want Klopp to be fuming. Um, but yeah, McAllister for 35 million is a bargain. Throw in to, um, to Man United. Wambasaka finds Bruno. Look at that from Wambasaka. Like, what is that? Great touch by Dallow. Oh, he's done Diaz as well for pace. Drives over the halfway line. Dallow finds Bruno Fernandes. Please improve your passing. Because it's been horrific. Here's Rashford. Left-hand side. Whips it into the area. Oh, no one can get a touch on it. And Keller collects it. You need Hoyland to step up. Oh, look at Casemiro. He moves like a double-decker bus reversing round a corner. It's in slow motion. Sabozlai so finds Bradley. Liverpool on the attack. Up against Wambasaka. Good block by Harry Maguire. The slab. Oh, come on! Have you not got a brain in that slab of yours, mate? Pass the ball! Ball whipped in. Darwin Nunes back post. Darwin Nunes is blocked. Kobe Mainu clears it. That's a foul ref. Get your cards out. Free kick to Man United edge of the box. Great game all of a sudden. Games come to life. Listen, somebody make, put the kettle on, make a hot chocolate for Casemiro, give him his slippers and get him off the pitch. He's moving like an old man, Casemiro. Honestly, he's moving like an old, one, uh, old man. So slow. And Gibb said this is an all-timer of a stream, by the way. Big up, bro. It will be if they get a result, United, I'm telling you. 
Gary Woolard, man, sorry about this. He said he lost his friend last week, then his wife died of a broken heart. Oh, man, terrible. Sorry for your losses, bro. Thank you for tuning in. Appreciate your support. Community's got your back, Gary, bro. Casemiro is a liability. Oh, he can't move. He genuinely can't move. Ball over the top by Anana, looking for Rashford. What's that? What's that? Offside? Come on, bro. That's basics. Casemiro is moving like a pensioner right now. He can't, he can't run. Maybe he'll have a stormer after I say this, so I'm going to try and inspire him. He, he can't move that guy, honestly. You would never think Casemiro played for Madrid. I, I think, like I said, it's like buying a good car with 170,000 miles on the clock. Like, it don't matter if it's a, a Rolls Royce, mate. The engine's knackered. And that's what Casemiro is. He's a great car with a dodgy engine that's on its way out, so... Everyone's saying, take care, Gary. Condolences. Big up the community supporting, Gary, man. Appreciate that. Big up. Big up, Gary, locked in. Ziggy said, Casemiro is finished. Bring Mount on. At least Mount will give them energy, and that's what they desperately lack. I, I would do that. Here come Liverpool again. Salah looking for some balls. Like, good defending. Be strong. How has he got out with the ball? Yes, giving it away. Anana collects it. Come on. Come on, United. If Ten Hag makes the right changes here, they can do something on the counter-attack. I'd take Casemiro off this pitch. He can't handle this. It's way too quick. Um, Who have they got on the bench? I mean, Mount, Amrabat, Eriksen. Eriksen, game's too quick for him. I don't really rate Amrabat. It's got to be Mason Mount. It's Kobe Mainu. Slips over. He manages to keep the ball. Maguire. Finds Wan-Bissaka in a bit of space. Ten Hag asking Steve McLaren his opinion. Blind leading the blind. You don't want to take out... Oh, my days. Casemiro gives it away. Liverpool on the counter-attack again. Casemiro's having a shocker. Maybe he'll score now. In fact, that's a great tackle. Absolute great tackle. Bruno, decent ball. Come on, Rashi, take him on. To oh, Kwanzaa, what a challenge. Good player, this lad, although he made the mistake for the goal, so I can't big him up that much. Casemiro actually made a great challenge after Anthony on the bench. I mean, I don't know whether I can say him. I think he's awful. Gary said, thanks to the community. Big up, bro. Good defending there by Diogo Dallo. Wins the ball back. Bruno gives it to Dallo. Dallo over the top looking for Bruno! Tried to volley it. Was he offside? If he was onside, that's a huge chance. This is literally a basketball game. They can't handle this. So Bozlai, it's too easy. I can't believe it. Darwin. Yeah, straight off Maguire's slab head. This game is too end-to-end. -end. I don't think United have got the energy for this. Casemiro gets hit with the ball, collapses to the ground. Just put him out of his misery. The guy's shattered. Absolutely shattered. Get him off. Was Bruno onside? Oh my days, he was. What a ball by Dallo. Tries, he's coming over his shoulder. He tries to volley it first time. Doesn't make good contact with it. Wow. Could have maybe scored there, you know. Casemiro... He's just so tired, he's pretending he's injured. He, you've got... Just take him off and put him out of his misery. Get Mason Mount on. Get Mason Mount on and take this guy off. Moses said, I love your show. You are special, bro. Big up. Special community. You're legends. 3,300 of you locked in. Big up each and every one of you. It's a shame McTominay's not on the bench because he actually is quite a clutch player for... Um, Man United, he seems to pop up with important goals. Uh, I said this in the first half. United haven't taken advantage. Joe Gomez coming on and they will take Connor Bradley off because Connor Bradley is on a yellow card and Rashford running at him is a problem. He'll put Gomez there. That's a foul. Surely, ref. Yep, foul by Diaz on Hoyland. Free kick to United. 26 minutes to go. Can Mount play as a six? You're right. I'm not sure he can. Oh, no. Rashford. He's injured. Rashford is down injured. Anthony's coming on. Wow. Ganacho will move to the left. Anthony to the right. 
I mean, Rashford hasn't done much. He's put a couple of good crosses in. That's not looking good. He's got his head down. He looks quite upset. Must be a muscular injury problem, but Rashford is coming off. Um, he's not happy. Rashford off. I thought Casemiro was coming off. Rashford's injured. Um, Fermo said this is one of the best watch-alongs I've seen. Big CA. Hey, big up, bro. Liverpool looks like they're bringing on Gomez. I think Harvey Elliott's coming on as well. It'll be Bradley for Gomez. Curtis Jones is coming on. Um, so a number of changes for Liverpool. So Anthony is coming on. So who's coming off? So Bosley comes off for Curtis Jones. That's the first change for Liverpool. Curtis Jones, I think he's been out injured for a little bit. Um, Connor Bradley, of course, comes off for Joe Gomez. Um, Big C, would you take Rashford from United and put him up front? I just don't know if Rashford is that good up front, you know. I think he's better on the left. Anthony comes on for Rashford, who's injured. Big loss for them, um, and I just don't know why. I suppose the reason that Casemiro's not coming off is they obviously don't think um, that Mount can play in that role, and he doesn't seem to rate Amrabat. Um, they've already said they won't take him at the end of the season on a permanent, and Ericsson definitely can't run. Hit the like button, people. Hit the like button. Big up, Rooney. Hope you're well, bro. Nunes having a shocker. Lucky for United. The game is so open. I just don't know if... I don't know if uh, Man United can keep up with this tempo. That's why I think Ten Hag needs to make a couple more changes. Here's Wan-Bissaka. Bruno Fernandes slips over as he kicks the ball. His passing's been absolutely horrific. Look at Casemiro's doing bicycle kicks. That's not a bad ball. Kobe Mainu, get it out wide. Get it out wide. Finds Ganacho. Wambasaka on the overlap. Ganacho finds Wambasaka. Come on, get a shot off. Kobe Mainu! Ah! Ah! Kobe Mainu! Kobe Mainu! Bends it into the top corner! And Manchester United take the lead! The generational talent! Kobe, Kobe, Mano! Come on! Vamos! Yes! Yes! United! 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 What a goal! Let's fucking go, guys! Let's fucking go! Let's do this! For the Gunners! Kobe, Mano! Bends it into the top corner! I wasn't swearing there, if anyone thinks I was swearing, by the way. You know, uh, Arteta says fogging. Um, but, hey, what a goal that is. That is unbelievable. Oh, my days. Scenes. What a goal. That is absolutely unbelievable. When he's shooting, I'm thinking, you can't bend it in from there. Oh, my days. What a goal. Picture Robert Perez away at Anfield for Arsenal. Opens up his body and bends it into the far top corner. That is incredible. Kobe Mainu, 18 years of age. I watched this guy in preseason against Arsenal. He bossed our midfield in New Jersey. He was 17 at the time. I said, this guy's maturity is unbelievable. Endo comes off. And Darwin Nunes comes off. Gakpo and Harvey Elliott come on. Oh, my days. Arsenal. What a result this could be. Jorge said, I've said it before. Liverpool are scraping points. HR reminds me of Makeda's goal. Probably even better. But although the turn from Makeda was great. LSU has gifted 10 Curtis Shaw TV memberships. This is what we need. Come on. Big up LSU. Thank you for the 10 memberships, bro. Wow. This is incredible. Glory, glory, Man United. Glory, glory, Man United. Glory, glory, Man United. And the Reds go marching. On, on, on. Yes. Come on, Arsenal. All in the name of the Gunners, people. All in the name of the Gunners. Manchester United 2. Liverpool 1. Unbelievable. I never saw this coming. They were horrific 
in the first half. Should have been 3-0 down. Kobe Mainu. What a goal. Bends it in the top corner. He's, he's not even facing the goal at the start. He's kind of got his back to the play. And he turns and just bends it in the corner. I was like, oh my days. What a goal. Absolutely incredible. 18 years of age. That lad is special. He is special. I wish he was at Arsenal. I can't lie. Wow. Long way to go, though. Long way to go. Long, long way to go with uh, the amount of attacks that Liverpool are going to have in this next 20 minutes. Plus time added on. Man United are going to need to make changes. Anthony does well there. Yaps it off Diaz. Good strength by Hoyland. You've got a fight. Yes! Free kick to United. United! 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 Come on! Let's go! Not only will the win benefit Arsenal, but it will damage Liverpool's confidence. This is what we need. Latte, big up, bro. He says, wow. If I give her the super chat, bro. This is what we are here for. United goal, says Ziggy. Yep, yeah, that's it. Coronation Street 2. Brookside 1. And um, Jimmy Corkill FC. Cannot believe it. And uh, big up. Let's get the likes up, people. 4,000 of you tuned in. Oh, my days, Onana. Twist up Gakpo. Cool as you like. Oh, what a touch. Come on! Come on! We want another one. End this game. Finish them off. Anthony. We got... Can I choose it? Casemiro play the damn ball. He's in loads of space. Give it to Wamba Saka. Although there's no point. Corner to United. United! 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 Come on! They can get the third here. They're rattled, mate. The Scousers are rattled. Love seeing Klopp um, gurning on it. Got teeth doing all sorts, mate. I don't know what's going off. Marco, I knew listening to Ray J this morning would work. If I had one wish, you will beat Liverpool. We'll be top of the league. We'll win the title again. If I had one wish. Corner to United. It was a uh, ball whipped in. Oh, keepers all over the place. Oh, it's a goal kick. Ah, dear. Let's calm down. Troy Kempi, let's go Arsenal. Could this be our year? Oh, please. I told you, I'm getting the passport, the wallet, and I'm going on tour. Feels strange seeing Big C shout United. All in the name of the Gunners, people. It's completely worth it. Um, just, just run with it. it. It makes sense. It makes sense. Long way to go. 18 minutes left. Ah, oh, dear. Come on. Gakpo's on. I do not rate Gakpo at all, but still got to be careful. Salah's there, isn't he? Um, hit the likes, people. Hit the likes. 4K in the building. Unbelievable numbers. These are like the numbers we get for Arsenal games, people. Amazing, amazing support. Really appreciate it. Lock on, though, people. It is a roller coaster. Go on. Go on, Rasmus. Go on, Rasmus. Take him on. Support him. United have a chance. Here we go. Ganacho. Oh, straight at the goalkeeper. Chance. 17 minutes to go. Shameless settings. That was off a chance, you know, I'm telling you. Come on, United. Get another one. You could be in. Rasmus Hoyland. Oh, they overhit the pass. He can't reach it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Big up Omar. I said, Curtis, we all love you. Hey, I appreciate it, people. I appreciate it. Remember, love is stronger than hate. Ah, oh, that's a poor shot. Passport and bank cards on start. That's it. Passport. Wallet. Wow. What a challenge by Kawhi Leonard. A.K.A. Kambuala. Steve McLeod, he could have broke his leg there. He's lucky. Hey, look at... Clop. Teeth all over. Chewing on his top lip. <laughs> Jürgen's going crazy, people. He's going absolutely mad. He's going to bite the fourth official. Oh, my days. <laughs> Klopp's going mental. I've never seen him like this. He can't... But look at him. He can't believe it. I think he's asking for a red card there. 
Kambuala, aka Kawhi Leonard. This is crazy, man. This is wild. Another goal here for United. I think it's done. But I'm not I'm not gonna um I'm not gonna get carried away. Liverpool will get chances. They will get chances. Bro, he's biting on his top lip. What's wrong with him? Looking like he's gonna get locked jaw, bro. What's moving like a dog? Come on, United. They had to bounce back. Haven't seen Curtis this excited since he heard Ozil was coming. Coming to Arsenal. Oh, Gakpo. Hey! Overhits it. Goal kick to United. Slow the game down now. Take your time. Take your time. Yeah, we need the AFCON ref now. Just blow full time now. I've seen enough. I've seen enough of the game already. I've had enough. End it. I tell you what, United need to make some changes. They, their team must be tired right now. Cryptic Dino, thank you for the super chat. Curtis, we are shameless today, bro. Watch Fan Zone from yesterday. I was on there saying we will win the league this season. I have no doubt about it. Hey, big up Dino. I hope you're right, bro. Speak it into existence. Um, Carl said it's, it's done already, mate. Liverpool is finished. Canacho does well. Is that a corner? No, Van Dijk clears it. Klopp's dentist must hate him. I'm telling you. He might love him because he probably smashes his teeth all the time and has to spend about um, a five grand fixing him. Klopp jaw. Man's got Klopp jaw. Not lock jaw, Klopp jaw. Uh, Hamdu said, I absolutely love your streams, Curtis. Big up to you, bro. Appreciate that. Texas Cannon, scarier teeth, Klopp or Suarez? I mean, oh, Joe Gomez volley. Sa saved by an honor. Um, well... The thing is, Suarez will actually bite you, so I suppose Suarez ones are even worse. Um, he will have a nibble on your shoulder if he gets the chance. Um, but hey, it is what it is. Big up to everyone locked in. 14 minutes to go, plus time added on. What a weekend this could be for Arsenal. And I suppose for Man City as well. You know, it does them a favour. Um, but we're focused on ourselves. We're only looking forward, not backwards. Suarez v Tyson in a bite-off, yeah. I can't believe Tyson's fighting Jake Paul. That's crazy. Um, wow. This is going to be a long 14 minutes plus time added on. Because we've had injuries, Rashford injury and a few substitutions, it's probably going to be a lot. Here's Joe Gomez right hand side. Find Salah edge of the box. Harvey Elliott, don't touch him. Gomez, Salah, force him backwards. Good defending. United have only made one change. I think they're going to need to make a couple more. Anthony came on for a, a Rashford who was injured. They're going to need to make more changes because they look tired. Jerome said, big up big C and commentary from biscuits to moments of brilliance. C unit, the special shameless one. Come on, you gunners. Big up, Jerome. Oh, ball whipped in. Headed away by United and cleared by Bruno. Jake said, my 29th straight day in hospital. Didn't expect this level of entertainment on a Sunday morning. Legend from the start, C. Big up this great community. Hope you're well in hospital, bro. Hope your recovery's going well. Let us know when you're out as well. Curtis, give me a gift. You know what? I can't give the gift to an individual person. If you gift memberships, it's then given by YouTube automatically. Um, so you can't like pick someone and gift them a membership. It doesn't let you do it. Here come Liverpool on the attack. Wow, this game's going so slow. Every time I look up, the time's not moving. Ball's in the air. Casemiro, that's a rubbish clearance. Oh no, Diaz! Saved by Anana comes out! Oh, Mo Salah puts it over the bar! Oh dear, six yards out, Mo Salah. Bouncing ball, and he puts it over. Anana's save was not great. He palmed it straight. Poor header away by Casemiro. Diaz hits it. Anana palms it out. I think he's actually in the six-yard box. I mean, he's six yards out there. Is on his right foot, but you expect him to hit the target there. A uh, change for Man United. Amrabat comes on. He's taken Garnacho off. It's an interesting change, that. You ain't got no real pace in your attack now. Anana gets a yellow card for time-wasting. 
So Anana is on. I think Bruno. I'm sure they just said Bruno's going to move out wide. Maybe it'll be Bruno, Anthony and Hoyland. And then Casemiro and Amrabat. I don't know how they're going to line up. This is crazy. 11 minutes to go. Anana gets booked. Park the bus. Maguire heads out. Throw into Liverpool near the halfway line. Big up follow in. He said, big up Curtis Hopalong. That's right up there at the top. Some way we'd be up there by the end of the season. Mad, bro. This is even more intense than watching Arsenal. It is. We were comfy yesterday, bro. Salah. Here come Liverpool. Given away by Joe Gomez. Casemiro. Terrible ball. Gives it away. You have to keep possession. Cody Gakpo overhits the pass. Diaz up against Dallo. They're going to have to work hard now. Two changes, man. I think he should have made another another one or two, maybe. Get Mason Mount on for his energy. Good tackle by Dallo on Luis Diaz. Throw into Liverpool. Corner of the Man United penalty area. Casemiro is way off the pace. He looks knackered. Should have took him off. Should have took him. He could have just done a straight swap for Casemiro. Um, Casemiro for Amrabat, sorry. He can play in that six roll. Any Man U fan is worth weight. His soul uh, wants an Arsenal title. Can't have Liverpool getting 20. City getting four in a row. The shame is real. Yeah, I agree. Deep Clean Mobile said, best up along ever. History will never forget. Bro, I'm telling you. Free kick to Liverpool. Over by the touchline. Robertson fouled by Anthony. Taken quickly there. Big up Curtis. Just tweeted at Arsenal. Make Kobe to Arsenal happen. He deserves better than this team. I'd take him at Arsenal all day long. Here's Harvey Elliott for Liverpool. Long way to go. Nine minutes left. Ball whipped into the area. Casemiro's clearance doesn't go far. Salah. Casemiro does clear it this time. Looking for Bruno. Bruno can't get there. Here come Liverpool again. Elliott. Salah. One, two. Penalty. No! You! You're a joke! Wamba Saka! You are a shambles! He's garbage. The worst footballer in Premier League history. Wamba Saka. You are a clumsy donut, mate. How are you a pro? Absolute shambles. Penalty to Liverpool. Wamba Saka, you bottle job. You absolute clown. He cannot help himself. Just stand up, bro. Elliot ain't going nowhere. Why are you diving in like that? He's a, I, I said it at the start. This guy's got the, the, the technique of a Sunday league player. Shambles. Absolute shambles. He can't help himself. He has to dive in. He's so bad. It's unbelievable. Come on, Andre and Anna, please. Save this penalty. Mo Salah. Scored 31 out of 38 penalties for Liverpool, but he's missed four of his last 11. Come on. Come on, Anana. Oh, na, 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 na. Oh, na, na, na. It's all about Anna. Anna, 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 Anna. I'm bringing the vibes to him. Come on, Andre Anana. Make yourself a hero. You need to save this. Mo Salah puts the ball down on the penalty spot. He's struggling to get the ball to stay on the penalty spot. I don't know what they've done to it. Mo Salah. He's missed four of his last 11 penalties. He's going to miss. He's going to miss. Come on. Come on, Anana. Come on, Anana. Come on, Anana. Let's do this. Save this penalty, you fraud. Here we go. Mo Salah against Anana. He scores. Sends him the wrong way. Cool as you like to all. Wamba Saka, you absolute fraud. You are the worst. The worst of the worst, mate. Mo Salah equalizers, opens up his body, sends him the wrong way. He's a shambles of a footballer, Wambasaka. Like a fish riding a bike. He waits for him to move, opens up his body. He goes too early, he should have waited. It's not even a good penalty, it's not in the corner. It's a definite pen. It's it's wild. The guy's a loose cannon, Wambasaka. He's got no ability to stand and just watch the ball. He has to dive in. He's, he's rubbish. Now, nah, look, six minutes plus time added on. You've took Garnacho off. Now you've got no pace. Look at Anthony. Loses the ball. Ah, oh, dear. 
most goals in the Premier League be Man United 11, Mo Salah, Shearer was 10, Aguero was next. Oh, dear. Can't stand Wambasaka. Kobe Maino off, Mason Mount on. So you're telling me Casemiro's in midfield looking like a double-decker bus reversing round a corner. Kobe Maino's had a good game, bent one in the top corner. Are you taking off Kobe and leaving Casemiro? I've seen more movement in the Statue of Liberty. Here's Andy Robertson, left-hand side, crossing situation. Anthony's clearance is poor. Diaz gets it back. Five minutes to go. Hoyland has done nothing today up front. Forces them back to Kelleher. How is Casemiro still on this football pitch? He can't move. He cannot move. Live Liverpool. Nah, listen, it's a pen. It's a pen. I, I can't lie. It's, it's clumsy as anything. We should have a field day at Old Trafford. I hope so. For some reason, they'll probably play better than this against us because it's Arsenal. Four and a half minutes to go, plus time added on. Mason Mount's on in midfield. Amrabat, Mount, Casemiro, midfield three. Come on, Casemiro. Wins the header. Liverpool get the ball. United are struggling to get the ball now. I'll take a draw all day long. Ball over the top looking for Diaz. Good tackle there by um, Dallo. Diaz wax into the advertising hoardings there. I've never understood why they do that, United. At the side of the pitch, it slopes down. The amount of players that you see just slip down there. Dallo and Diaz there, both hurt. I think Diaz actually hit the advertising um, board. I think Dallo's all right. He hurt his hands. This is stressful. This is this is hard. This is more difficult than watching Arsenal yesterday. We we you know we won our game easy. Let's get the likes up. Eckhart said I accept a draw. A draw, I will take it all day long. Because they've been horrible. They've they stepped up second half, but more movement in the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> ah dear, old school drainage system. Is that what it's about? Yeah, to get the water off the pitch. Goal kick to Manchester United. Andre Anana, don't do anything stupid. Just play. Here's Harry Maguire. Just, just whack it upfield. Oh, I told you. Why are you trying to play out? You're not that guy, bro. Liverpool throwing. Know your limitations, bro. Cruz, big up. United, United. The shamelessness runs in the family, bro. We better win this game. Well, if United draw this game, this is actually like a win for Arsenal. Hey, Maguire and Diaz getting into a scrap. Hey, come on. Imagine the difference in accent. You got Maguire like, shut your mouth, Diaz. Like, come to Sheffield, I'll knock you out. And Diaz like, la puta madre, Maguire. You fridge. Um, yeah, if we don't, if, if United don't draw this game, I delete this stream. It never happened. This level of shamelessness cannot be online unless it benefited Arsenal. Here's Harvey Elliott. Three minutes to go. Salah gives it away. Amrabat gives it away. He's rubbish. Rubbish. Mo Salah. Yes, that's not a foul. Come on, United. You got anything on the break? Hoyland, play it. That's a free kick. Hey! Yellow card as well, surely. Yellow card there. Free kick to Man United on the halfway line. And a yellow card for Curtis Jones. Stuart said, thanks for the stream, Curtis. I'm stressed more than I game yesterday. I'm telling you. Haroon said, man said, puta madre, you fridge. <laughs> got a G said, I have to go. Father due his blessings, bro. Catch on tomorrow's stream. Big up. Um, 2 p.m. will be there. Pitch slope drainage. Okay, Martin. Yeah, I get, it makes sense. Come on. Minute and a half of normal time left. Free kick. Amrabat heads it in the air. Maguire. Gets the knockdown. Where are you, United? Just standing there watching him. You know Maguire's probably going to win that header. Mason Mount, come on, do something. Gakpo gets right off there. No! Salah's one-on-one. -on -one. Great tackle. Yes! Bruno Fernandes gets back and recovers. Salah was one-on-one -on -one with a goalkeeper. Out of nowhere, one pass. Why is this Man United defence so open? 
Jorge said I would have taken a tie before the game started. Yeah, listen, a draw is a good result. I take that, but just please hang on. How long is going to be added? Kelleher on the ball for Liverpool. Finds Virgil van Dijk out to Robertson. 30 seconds of normal time to go, but I think there will be a good few minutes added on. Rashford's injury, we've had a few changes. Diaz gets it out wide to Elliot up against Wambasaka, rolls it to Gomez. It's blocked. This problem's all oh, is cleared. What kind of clearance is that, Casemiro? Ball whipped in back post. Oh, Bruno puts it out for a corner. The stress levels are through the roof. 90 minutes gone. How long? Seven minutes. No. No. You're a joke. It's Ian Rush holding up the board. He's a Liverpool fan. Seven minutes added on, man. What? Corner to Liverpool. I can't watch it. Ooh, sir. Jeez, this is hard to watch. This is worse than watching Arsenal. Head this away, Maguire. Straight off your slab. Corner. Robertson, in-swinger. Need to win the header. Goes all the way across. Salah keeps it. Yes! Free kick to Manchester United. Wow, this is difficult. Am I doing a Chelsea watch-along? Absolutely no chance. I don't do relegation battles, bro. Chelsea against Sheffield United. And by the way, the stress of this game, there ain't no more watch-alongs today. Casemiro is fasting, apparently. Well, that's fair enough. You can understand him being tired, but the guy's knackered. Manager should have took him off. Oh, it's lazy from um, Hoyland. Doesn't even challenge. Ball's up in the air. Harvey Elliott flicks it on. Maguire, great clearance. Go on, Hoyland. Make a nuisance. Get out for a throw. Yes! Throw in to United. I'm wanting Man United to slow down and take the draw. The guy's running to get the ball. Maguire's down injured. He's all right. Nothing wrong with him. Big up Snake Eyes, he said, for my grandchild crew there. Big up, bro. Appreciate that. Big up everyone for the kind com uh, comments to Cruz as well. Appreciate that, bro. Let's get the likes up, people. Four and a half K in the chat. Here's Wamba Sakari. He wins a throw in. Guy's an absolute clown. Like a fish riding a bike, as that guy once said. Throw in to United. Can they get a late winner? It would be something. Come on, Wamba Saka. Throw the ball, mate. It's not that difficult. Just throw it before you get booked for time wasting. Hoyland. He's had a poor game. Good ball by Bruno. Hoyland, you've, uh, you are rubbish, mate. Ramba Saka as well. Look, look how clumsy he is. Just take him out early. Take him out. Yeah, love that. Wipe him out, yes. Well done, Mason Mount. Take that yellow card. Wipe him out. Don't let uh, Gakpo start running there. They had a wild counter-attack on. You just got to trip him up there. Hoyland, mate. Boy, 60, 70 million. This is why we have to get our striker move right. Here's Harvey Elliott in the area. Pulls it back. Wambasaka. Terrible clearance. Straight to Macau. He's dreadful, that guy, Wambasaka. Honestly. Two, two minutes and 50 seconds of the seven minutes gone. We've got four minutes to go, people. It's going to be a long four minutes. Liverpool with possession. Kwanzaa into the Man United half. Harvey Elliott in loads of space. Whips it into the area. Anana doesn't come for it. It's too far. Robertson heads it in. Oh, my days. Luis Diaz puts it over. Seven yards out. How has he missed? I thought the referee was giving a foul. Amrabat and Anthony are having an argument. Diaz should have scored. Anthony's cursing at someone. Oh, my days. What a chance. Weak from Anthony. Look at Dallo. You're on the wrong side. Oh, my. How has he missed that? He's a yard outside the six yard box. Anthony's got to be stronger. That is absolutely pathetic. That sums him up. Diaz, seven yards out on the volley, puts it over. He has to hit the target. He has got to score that. Anthony, mate, you are, you are a whatless brother. How on earth are you trying to get a free kick for that? It's embarrassing. Stand your ground and challenge. Bro, they had a goal kick. Liverpool have got the ball back already. Two minutes and 50 seconds to go, people. 
Dallo. Looking for Mason Mount. Come on. Come on. United on the break. Anthony. Hoyland makes the run. Here's Anthony. Bruno Fernandes. What you got? Gives it away. You're an absolute joke, mate. He could not pass wind, that guy. His passing today has been atrocious. He can't stop giving the ball away. Honestly, they had a chance there. He just passes it. Straight to Liverpool. Two minutes and ten seconds to go, people. I'm counting this game down by the second. Kwanzaa on the halfway line. Forced all the way back to Kelleher. Two minutes. Two minutes to go, people. We're less than two minutes now. Win the header, Maguire. Be strong. Great header. McAllister wins it. you got to press Amrabat. Come on. Come on. No. He gives a free kick to Liverpool. Halfway line. Minute and 45 seconds to go. Liverpool have possession. What a game. Straight to Andre Anana who collects it. Anana picks it up. Slow down, bro. Stop forcing the game. This is wild. This is what a title race does to you people. Liverpool have the ball again. Cleared long. Maguire heads it out. Throwing about five yards into the Liverpool half. Smash a like. Minute and ten seconds to go, people. Big up Dean Burkett. He says, uh, Big C, much love and big up to you and yours. Thank you, my Sunday's complete proper channel. We're not there yet. Here's Hoyland. Lift your head. Here we go. It's Anthony. Anthony shot deflected straight at Kelleher. Why does he not smash that with power? He could have won that. He just got no power. He's an awful footballer. Wins the ball back though. Fair play. 40 seconds to go. Here's Amrabat. Right hand side. In the Liverpool half. Given away by Amrabat. But he wins the throw in. It's gone ref. It's gone. It's our play. Wipe him out. Diaz, 20 seconds to go. Great tackle. You're a joke, you bold fraud. It was a throw. Free kick to Liverpool. I've never seen anything like it. The ball was out of play for a throw in. He doesn't give it. He plays on. Now Liverpool have got a free kick on the edge of the box. I can't watch this. Seven minutes are up. If you'd have given the throw in... It would have been game over. Now Liverpool got a free kick about 35 yards out. They're going to whip this in. Everyone's in the box. I can't watch it. I cannot watch this. Honestly, man, I've sat here for 95 minutes doing the most shameless Man United celebrating ever. 97 minutes. Don't you dare do this to us. We don't deserve this. Robertson. Whips it into the area. It's high. It's flicked away. Comes out to Elliot. Saved by an honor. Yes. Yes. Noodle head. Yeah. Full time whistle goes. There we go. Come on, you got us. Yeah, I said. Yeah, I said. Yeah, I said. Come on. The Scousers drop points. We lead the Premier League title race. It's in our own hands, people. Manchester United 2, Liverpool 2, drop points for Liverpool. There's no way they shouldn't have won that game. Massive result for the Gunners. Big, big result that. Wow. One of the most stressful watch-alongs of the season. I spent most of the first half talking about sweets and biscuits. The second half came to life. All right, here's my tweet. On behalf of all Arsenal fans, thank you for your efforts today, United. The draw is appreciated. P.S. You're still crap. Right, there we go. Uh, <laughs> yes! That's it now. No more kind words. Um, no more kind words. Man United, mate, you're rubbish. You ain't winning nothing and 10 Ogs are bold fraud. Oh, let's look at that table. 
Show me the table. Not show me the money. Show me the table. Woo! Well, what's going on here? Villa, get them off the screen. Look at that. Genuinely top of the league. Not no games in hand. Not no goal difference. Well, for us, it's goal difference. Colby Mainu. Thank you, my friend. Always said you're an absolute baller. Back to default now. United, you're garbage. You're rubbish. I don't rate you. You ain't winning nothing anytime soon. Liverpool, oh yes. You bottled it today. You should have won, but you didn't. The table is a thing of beauty right now. Are we going to do it? It's in our hands. You win seven games, you lift that Premier League title. It's the best Premier League season in recent history. We go on tour, we go to the parade, we clean out the armory and get all the merch. And we have the summer of all summers, people. What a game of football. What a game of football. Solomon, any clips? Email me, bro. Wouldn't mind getting another one up for that, for the TikTok. Wow, 5,200 of you locked in. Man United, it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure today. Like I said, we're going back to default settings now. So, you know, they're rubbish. And, I, you know, I can't even fit them on the screen. But we're, it's in our hands, people. Pole position. Where's the guy who said we should give up already? No chance, bro. Glory, glory, Man United. Check the table, says White Glove. Beresford Productions. To all Gooners, you're welcome. No losses against Liverpool this season. I've always rated Ten Hag. Dud Pistachio, no therapy, shameless settings, Monday morning. Well worth it, bro. Sebs, top of the league. We are top of the league. We are top of the league. Beresford Productions, gifted five memberships. Big up, bro, you legend. And uh, listen, man, oh, that was hard work. It was painful. Southern Guna, Matt, go and subscribe to his channel. Big up, Matt, doing good content. All we have to do is one game at a time. It's getting tight. It is, bro. It is. You can't look too far ahead. At the end of the day, we've got a, a monster game on Tuesday that isn't the Premier League. We've just got to play and play, and, and you're right, break it down into just a game, a game, a game. Uh, TM said, this stream might be iconic come May. I really hope it is. I really hope it is, bro. I enjoyed it. Jorge said, if Arsenal win the league, my wallet will suffer. Listen, it's only money, people. Enjoy it while you've got it. Mohamed, thank you for the super chat, bro. Mission accomplished. Come on, you gunners. Oh, wow. Wow. What a Sunday. Listen, we don't, we're not going to get too carried away. It's all in the name of the game and banter and supporting the ops. It's what we're here for, and we'll do it again. We will do it again um, at some stage in the season because it's, it's what is required, probably. David said, best stop along in the biz, get Cruiser Yellow 29 kit with adverts on it. Listen, man... Um, and you're right. Big up my brother, Akeem, man. I mean, Wambasaka, what are you doing? What are you doing, bro? Like, he's going nowhere. Harvey Elliott, edge of the box, you're in front of him, and you dive in like a wild animal. I thought it was David Attenborough. It was like a lion attacking a gazelle out in the wild, like he had to attack. Just stand up, relax, and block the shot. He ain't going nowhere. Man just dived in. Bop, bop, bop. Just took out it. Like a fish riding a bike, as that brother once said. They could have actually won the game. But it's funny. I spent nearly all of the first half saying, this is the worst performance I've ever seen from Bruno Fernandes. His passing today was horrific. But what a moment of brilliance. He lobs the keeper from 45 yards out. Uh, he's still a rat, though. He's still master splinter. He still dives. He still rolls around. He still moans at everyone. He still gives the ball away all the time. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Listen, Kobe Mainu, though. I'm going to be honest. We're going to round up now. But Kobe Mainu, what a player. And I'm not one to get um, hyped up too much on English players because we do it all the time in this country. Jack Wilshere's the new Paul Gascoigne. Then his ankle melts. You know, uh, you hear it all the time with these guys. And next minute. But this lad, Kobe Mainu. Number one, yeah. I'm with, I'd take him at Arsenal all day long. But obviously, we're not going to be able to. But he is some player. I'll tell you why. You don't see many 18-year-olds playing centre-mid. Centre-mid's a different game of football. You've got to do everything. 
got to run forward, score goals, create, be good on the ball, keep the ball, win your tackles. I, I've always said centre mid's one of the hardest positions on the pitch, especially for a young player. He's Man United's best midfielder. He's better than um, Casemiro. He's better than McTominay. He's better than um, Ericsson. Special, special player. Really is. Um, and fair play to him. What a goal. What a goal. The sad thing for him, he, he should be in a better team. Imagine if he was in the Arsenal team next to Declan Rice. Do you know what I mean? Imagine if he was in the Man City team. He, he is an unbelievable young talent. Um and he saved us today. Uh, rise for today. He said, at the Gunners pub in Highbury, more Liverpool fans here than Arsenal fans. Just told them all to F off. Come on, you Gunners. It's in our hands. Big up, rise for today. And Brian said, man, you ha uh, have the most undisciplined team in the Prem. I agree. They're stinky, but today they did their job. I want to say a big thank you to everyone in the community. And uh, I'll tell you another thing. If Man United play like they played today, we will clip them up. That will be light work. You guarantee they play better than that against us. Thank you very much. Big big thank you to the community today. To get over 5,000 people in a stream of two teams that I don't support and for you guys to, to join in with all the, you know... Um, the comments and everything. Absolute legends, all of you. Enjoy your Sunday. Tomorrow, I'll be doing Arsenal v Bayern Munich preview. That will go out on AFTV, I believe, tomorrow evening. I'll be back on here at 2pm. We'll do our Arsenal content, look back over the Brighton game. And then, um, obviously, we'll look ahead to Tuesday that you could argue is one of the biggest games of football in years for Arsenal Football Club. Bayern Munich against Arsenal, Champions League quarterfinal. It don't get much bigger than that. Enjoy your Sunday. Take care. Thank you very much, Manchester United. It's been a pleasure, but you're still rubbish. I don't rate you. Take care, everyone. Bless. Come on.